I look like a giant. You're a giant in the distance. Pew, 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 pew. Bang, bang, bang. Fuck it. That's the best you're getting. That's the best you're getting. He's not, he's just chilling, right? He's going to stop moving, is he? Shit. <laughs> Shit. Shit, Clara, <laughs> no, fucking hell. Ah, I can't jump over him. Clarence, okay. <laughs> fucking fucked it. Tell me if I'm coming on too strong. I don't know. Fuck. Have you gone? Is this it? Are you doing it? What's going on? I'm about to really go. Can you see me? You can't see me. I can. All right. Yeah, I see. I see you. <laughs> ah, I just did it as well. <laughs> 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 Did you make it, Walls? Yeah. It's Funk Albert. He's behind a curtain. What, have you, what are you doing? I was looking at this picture of a dog. <laughs> Look, he's really nice. Nathan. Are the, are the lights oh, on? Oh, he is actually really nice. It's a cute dog. <laughs> Sorry you caught me doing that. I think it's even worse than having meatballs. <gasps> it's the doorbell. I think my delivery's here, guys. Thanks, mate. Is this the six foot longs I ordered? Cheers. Yes, where are you? Can you move slightly because I can't move behind the tree? <laughs> okay. Thank you. I sent wave after wave with my them. own Sorry. men at them. I can, I I can look out. They've thrown a grenade. There's a grenade near my body. It Th may kill me. Goodbye, Thank you, Astaz. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Astaz. I'll be with you in just a minute. Right, I think they're where <laughs> they are as well. Yeah, they've got the circle on their side as well. Finger Finger. Can you hear crunching? Or is that you eating? <laughs> <laughs> you fucking bastard. <laughs> are we gonna get eaten by a ghost because of you? Hey, you're toast. Oh wow, did you hear that? That must have been a remix. Hello everybody, welcome to my stream. I'm Adadad. And I used to run the Pod Bible. Cool remix. Um Astaz, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in everybody. Hope you had a good time, Az. I was enjoying uh your stream for a bit this morning and then I had to crack on with work but I saw you playing some Metal Gear man that game looks so old um, Metal Gear Solid 1 were you playing? when did that actually come out? it looks like it came out in 1992 or something hello Midnight Muse's girlfriend yes hello Midnight Muse's girlfriend how are you doing? and also hello Midnight Muse um, better known as you got this get that kit prepped um i heard about your music video that you're doing when i was lurking in your stream and it sounds really fucking cool and i love your ghillie suit 
uh, and everything I've seen of yours is top notch and you're going to smash it. So stop stressing out, okay? Thank you, Midnight Muses girlfriend. I mean, that's, you wouldn't say hello. You wouldn't say thank you, would you? If you met someone for the first time and you went hello and they go hello, you wouldn't go thank you. Thank you for saying hello back. They'd find that weird. I don't think I can salvage this. Sorry. Sorry, Midnight Muses girlfriend. Uh, as has Ryan, I'm off for a big... I read that as a... I'm off for a big we. <laughs> right, I'm off for we big man's first ever sports day. Oh, that is so cool. I hope he does well. Really funny about sports days. You get some kids who just freeze on the, on the start line. Uh, you get some kids who just couldn't give two fucks. You get some kids who try really hard to win. Um, as long as they try and they take part and they have a nice time is the main thing. Have fun, Astaz. That sounds great. Good luck if they do a dad's race, but they don't seem to do those anymore. They don't seem... To, well, at my school, they don't. As in at my child's school. If I had to do a child's school sports day, because we've got sports day soon, if we had a dad's race, it would be awful timing. My legs are a mess since um since the big walk i went out for my first run this morning since i did the big walk and since recovering from being ill and i'm trying and do at least 5k every time i did about 2k and then i've kind of pulled my calf and then my ankle where i broke my ankle a couple of years ago felt really sore too and i'm hobbling around like a an old man i feel like an old man oh my gilly goodness Frolicals, thank you so much Thank you for continuing to sub, as always, Frolly. You're a legend. Thank you so much for that. I hope you're good. Um, I'm doing all right, apart from feeling old when it comes to my legs. Old legs, young heart. Average aged torso. Wise head. That's my catchphrase. Hello, Pete. Thank you very much for being here early in the chat. Moobs, how you doing? Straight in after I went live. Hello, sheep. I um, hope you're all well. Austin Crab just got shot. Will everybody stop getting sh shot? Matt, but less, Matt, but less common. I, I never try and say your full name, and that's why. Hello, Matt. Nice to see you. Hello, Tilda. Nice to see you. Big Taff Man. Definitely don't walk the dog. The dog's going to be fine. Ralph doesn't strike me as the kind of dog that gets all hyper if he doesn't get walked. Also, you've got a dog walker, haven't you, for some time? So just get the dog walker over today and watch the stream. Hello, Slothy. Hello, Mary. Hello, Cherry. Thank you for lining up with three names that kind of rhymed. Well, that ended in E. Uh, hello, SCF. How you doing? Are you watching from the train? Are you having a good train journey? Uh, who else? Weezier. Hello. Stranded, hello. Polly, hello. Nice to see you. Um, Les Desnes. Afternoon, Daddy Addy. Hey, I was going to wait until we're a bit further into the stream, um, but uh, until like, there might be more people here, but I'm just going to reveal the news now because you've, you guys, it's 10 minutes in, you've got your alerts or you know it's 1.15 on a Tuesday, so you know I'm starting to stream or you just happen to be in my chat and I went live. Whatever happens, you're here early. We have big news in the Richardson household, in our house, because yesterday, Alex, who's my daughter, who is eight, received post. She never receives post. It looked official. Like it had, it was typed and it had a little window in the envelope. And we were like, what is this? Anyway, it turns out it was something that we sent off for about four months ago. You ready? Some of you won't know what this is. Most of you will. Not jury service, Frolicals. I can't believe I'm holding one. <laughs> yes! 
I love that you're actually all excited, or a lot of you are excited. She's got a Blue Peter badge. Hey, I mean, it's not that hard to get one, but it is a faff. So Alex basically made a big a picture, like a mixed media picture months ago um, with lovely trees. In fact, have I got a photo of it? I'm going to show you the picture that was sent. Because I don't, I don't really ever show you any stuff because a lot of the people, a lot of people don't give a two shits about other people's kids, and rightly so. Um, and you've never seen a picture of Alex. Some of you have heard her when she came on mic. Anyway, she made this picture out of felt and cotton wool uh, and little googly eyes. And she put that um, so it's like a painted background and then s some other elements. And we put that in an envelope and she wrote a letter talking to um, Blue Peter about um, the import, like loving the environment and wanting to do your bit for the environment because we know the Blue Peter people are going to love that shit. Um, hello, Mac. No, you haven't. Just talking about um, Blue Peter. And she sent that off. And we, we put a, we didn't put a stamped addressed envelope like I used to, but we put our address and some other details. And it, anyway, it said on the, on the website that it could take up to a year before you get a response. And if you don't know Muse, Blue Peter is like a national institution here. It's been going for at least, is it 50 years, 60 years? Blue Peter, it's a BBC program, kids TV every Friday live. Um, they've had loads of different presenters. I used to watch it a bit. It started in 1958. 1958. They've had loads of different presenters. These are the current presenters. That are really good. Um, and they do cookery, arts, crafts, all kinds of different things. Anyway, my daughter loves it. She watches it loads. Well, Mac, you might have missed it. And Emily, I'm so sorry to show this again. But yeah, Alex got one yesterday. Katie Hill, for a yeah. Katie Hill, um, Richard Bacon. Richard Bacon, I think, is the only person to get fired from Blue Peter for doing coke at a BBC party. But maybe we'll move on from that. Um, Connie Huck. Only one to get caught. Good point. Yeah. I mean, I, I didn't watch it loads, but it was on every week. So I'd watch it fairly regularly. Anyway, Alex is well chuffed. And the cool thing now about Blue Peter is they have a number of different badges. Um, how to earn Blue Peter badges. What was that 1958 series like? Married Biscuits, fucking hell, Daff. Yes. Uh, could ask David. So look, they've got all these different badges. One of them was designed by Ed Sheeran, the music badge, which is this one. This one, the sports badge, was designed by Leah Williamson. I actually don't think they had anything to do with these, but the England um, women's football captain, I don't think they actually did any designing. There's the gold one, which they give out to the big celebs, like they gave one to the king. Uh, they gave, they've given one to David Beckham. You know, a, huge A-listers, the king, David Beckham. Uh, that's the classic badge. You can get one for reading. You can get one for doing green stuff. What's this one? Doing something that makes a difference in your community. It's, it's good stuff. It's good stuff. And they reply to every single child and she got a personalized letter that was like, I really love your artwork because of this, this and this. It wasn't just a generic thing. And this is an example of why paying the license fee is worth it. Because um, BBC gets a lot of dogs abuse, um, sometimes worthy. Sometimes, obviously, they're, in many areas of their coverage, they try and appease people that shouldn't be appeased. But when it comes to kids stuff, CBBC, CBBS, Blue Peter, it's really good stuff. Uh, anyway, so Alex is now going to try and get the other badges.
exciting times. And actually pretty good quality. Look, it's one of these, um, it's, it's one of those that's got the thing on the back and the pin. That's a good cut type of badge. Not one where you have to, it's like a safety pin. Shit, I just got a reminder on my phone to do something that I really should have done. Uh, move it to tomorrow. Keep moving it. Anyway, hope everyone's good. Stranded, you might be right about the, uh, the design. Quentin Blake. Sheeran claims to have designed one of Ipswich's kits too, so he's got previous for these kinds of claims. That's cool. Do you get them for different stuff like Scouts? Daughter has just joined Brownies. Frilly, I don't know. I think you can, if, basically, if you can be bothered to write in, um, create something and send it in, then, uh, then they'll get back to you eventually. Um, but it's exciting. Like, and then she's like, can we go and do some litter pitting, picking? Because if we could go and do, like, do some litter picking and we could take a photo and then I could get a badge. So I'm like, well, yeah, that's good that you want to do that. But as long as it's not just to get the badge, like we should do it regularly. Um, litter picking. Hello, Barma. Barma, did you see? Look. We've got a Blue Peter badge in our house now. It's very exciting. <laughs> Ed Sheeran's tattoo's bad. Ed Sheeran tattoos. Wow, he's got a lot. Has he got a fresh Prince of Bel-Air one? Everything that happens is from now on. So it says, that says how on. He's got some frames. Everything that happens is from how on. He's got some frames. He's got shitting loads of tattoos. He loves color. He can't say he doesn't enjoy color. Some people are like, I'm not sure if I'll go for colors with my tattoos. Sorry about this, everybody, but we're going, we're going deep. We're doing a full on analysis. He's into Ireland, but you know, he did that song called Galway Girl. Puzzle pieces. Because life is a jigsaw. Footprint. Because every step you take is the most important step. Frosty. What's that called? Snowflake. Because sometimes it gets cold. Are these poppies? Are these poppies? It's called a freezer symbol. Thank you, fish. Uh, 58 with a shuttlecock. What does that say? That's probably some Irish. A uh, big close up in the armpits. We have a tomato ketchup on the shoulder. Wow, Mac, this is really intriguing. We've got a little, we've got the fish from the Simpsons, so that's cool. Uh, Rolling Stones. What flag is that? That's an African country and I can't remember which one it is and I feel bad. Galway, we've got the lock. Ghana, good work, everyone. Truly awful shark. Somebody's drawn that in Gartic. Of course. There's some... Uh, I don't know. I, I, I wouldn't want to guess what language that is. Does that say it was the blurst of times? Do you know, there's elements here that could have gone well, that could have gone better. This is like child's, like a child is, you should just submit Ed Sheeran to uh, Blue Peter. But anyway, he's doing his thing. He's, he's living his best life. He's obviously got a lot of these as a, as a drunken bet. Look. Oh no. But that's, is that no heartbreak? Right, arguably we've spent too much time on this. Crossword in a bit, crossword in a bit, everyone. They do look like crayon. They look like felt, like felt tips. Like if I let Alex draw all over me with felt tips and then just left it and they're all like 
and it turned out it was permanent markers and then I never shower again or expose myself to any elements. Someone who was a big chicken when getting tattoos I respect how much he's got. Some of them are a choice. Yeah, I quite like when people are like, fuck it, just get anything. Not get anything, but like, I like the idea that I'm just going to get it and don't have regrets. I would be constantly looking going, I fucked up. Oh God, I've absolutely fucked up here. Austin, there probably are some of those at some, some point. I don't listen to Ed Sheeran, but hope his music and lyrics are more sophisticated than his tattoos. Oh, very much so. Anyway, um, I don't really have too many strong feelings about Ed she Sheeran either way, but my feelings have somewhat changed having seen the uh, tattoos. How's everyone doing? Thank you for coming in to this. I was about to say thank you for coming back. That sounds a bit a bit pathetic. Uh, thank you for coming to watch and for being about. If any of you were here last night, you would have seen me play, str I was about to say Stranded Deep because I've read the word stranded. I wasn't even playing that. Um, I was playing The Forest. I'm going to continue to play that today, even though we lost uh, about an hour of gameplay because of because I died walking into the fire um, and I hadn't saved it for ages. I didn't achieve that much. It's one of those things where I will pretty quickly i hope be able to get back to where i was all i need to do is go and get some rope um and today is all about collecting resources we're going to get lots of rocks we're going to get lots of logs we're going to get lots of sticks and i'm going to build maybe we don't worry about the raft and we actually build a proper hut like like house <clears throat> mac you've uh, the tattoos i've seen that you've got a uh, I was about to say pretty cool, but that doesn't sound like I'm actually giving you praise. Uh, uh, cool. I really like that you're uh, your actual prince one, as in the, the crown, which is part of your branding. Did you get that after you started streaming or did you always have that and then you used it for streaming? I might get a little TV. Would you let Ed Sheeran do grouting in your bathroom? Fair, thank you, Fish. Um... Yeah, I would actually. If he turned up at the door, I'd see those tattoos. I'd be like, okay, I could imagine him with one of those utility belts and like baggy trousers with loads of pockets uh, ready to come around and be handy. Thank you, Pickleby. Please do come back. You got it after as part of a big charity stream thingy. It, but it works. It works really well because it's like a cool, it's a cool tattoo on its own. And it's not one where people will be like, what's that? And then you have to go, oh, uh, I'm, I'm a Twitch streamer. And they go, what's Twitch? Um, it works as a good standalone tattoo. Ah, I'm sure you're pleased to have my validation. Should we do the crossword? Haven't won it yet. Have I just jinxed it? Oh! And we play 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 Every day, every day, every day, every day We're gonna do the crossword, crossword 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 Dun, 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 dun. Also, what's sheep saying? Taff was right about progressing Oi. the story. Um, what did Taff say about progressing the story? I can't remember. I think we have another five to six stream then streams then bin due to the new Rust server. Um, yeah, I was thinking about this last night. I am enjoying this game, but it is quite slow progress so far, and I think. Yeah, I reckon like three more streams and unless I'm like actually am thriving and have made a lot more progress, then I can imagine it not lasting forever. I don't know. How big a game is it? Oh, did a little burp. The forest completion time. Oh, what can I Google that won't? Oh, great. Now I know exactly how it ends. No, not really. Uh, 15 and a half hours in length. 
if you're a gamer that strives to see all aspects of the game, you're likely to spend around 58 hours. Wow. Right, so 15 and a half hours, but let's face it, I am, I've lost an hour. I've already, um, the first day, I probably have only achieved about one hour in game or two hours so far. So we've got, we've got a lot to do. In co-op, you can rest respawn. Hello, B. Nice to see you. I'm just about to do the crossword. I'm only about an hour in. Oh my God. How to beat? I've got how long to beat here. This. We'll, see, we'll just see. We'll just see. I'd like to complete it, but it depends. If I'm enjoying it and it's fun and people are enjoying watching it, then we'll keep going. Um, but I'm really up for continuing to play at the moment. I like the fact that last night quite, we got quite a few um, people just coming in because they like watching the forest. So we'll get into it in a bit. And it's cheaper than that at the moment if anybody wants to buy it. Hello, Sparkle Muffin. Oh my gilly goodness. Hello, John. Thank you very much for the resub. Oh, by the way, uh, where is it? We've got a new sound alert, which is Triumph. I thought I wanted to get a portal one in. And so I've got the song from the end. Look. This was a triumph. I'm making a note here. Huge success. That might be... What was the volume like on that? Hopefully that volume... Oh fine. Oh my gilly goodness. There you go. So when, they, when I have a triumph, we can play that. And I have lots of triumphs here. When you get to the point where you're bored of it, you should draft me and Mac in to lift you up. Okay. I will. Oh, what do you mean? Like, to join me multiplayer or just to, like, get in a Discord call and you guys motivate me? Tarantula Lansbury. Thank you very much for the subscription. Forgot the word then, as if I haven't said it. Thank you very much, Tarantula. That's very kind of you. Thank you for seven months. Thank you, John, again, for 23 months. Thank you, Frolicals, for 22 months. <gasps> Cherry. Cherry's asked me a question. Hello, Cherry. Sorry I missed your question. Have you got tats? And if not, would you ever consider them? What is it you like in tattoos on others, if anything? What a comprehensive question. Um, I don't have any tattoos. And there's no particular reason. When I, well, when I was younger, I was like, I don't ever want to get tattoos because I'm such a... Um, I'm kind of like a big perfectionist when it comes to design work and like any of my... And I'm a massively critical of stuff that I've done. And so much of my design work, I look back on now and go, that's shit. Um, I 100% would not be able to just allow a tattoo artist just to do their thing. I'd have to fully choose what I want. And then I'm terrified of being like, that line is just slightly too thick or that is not centered or it's not symmetrical or anything like that. Um, and for years that worried me. Then... And guess what, guys? Just like with every fucking thing else, I'm going to bring it back to my dead friend. When Tom died, I was like, I'm going to get a tattoo. And I was speaking to his wife, and she was going to get a little tattoo like to do with something. And uh, I've got a plan, and I've chosen what it's going to be, and I just haven't got around to doing it. And so I'm going to do it, and I will do it. But yeah, I don't have any. And I kind of wish I did, because I, I genuinely think they're cool. And I think... Um, most people I know have got them. They look badass. Uh, there are loads of people who are part of the Twitch community who've got them, and I think they look great. Uh, and I can see how it would be really exciting to get a new one. Um, it feels a bit late to start, but also, who gives a fuck? Uh, age is just a number, right, ladies? My cousin, who's a designer, has the worst fucking time getting tattoos. I don't envy her. I've often thought she should hang it up. Also, she made me get a buddy tattoo she backed out of. Tattoos, not for everybody. Yeah. Thank you, Cherry. Good question. Um, but yeah, the plan that I've got is for a very basic sort of shape. There's no color. 
Uh, it's like an isometric shape, but it's got a little reference in it to do with Tom. Nothing, no words, no pictures, no initials, no dates, no beef or shade to anybody who's got anything like that. But it's just a very basic thing. And I was going to get it under here, like under here. And then loads of people said that would be mega painful, but I think I'll just do it anyway. I can go through the pain. Also, I was supposed to get a tattoo that said Chatmax on one of my toes because I'm, I'm in a WhatsApp group called Chatmax, which is um, a hangover from a Skype group that I was in called Chatmax when I was at my old job. And me and my friend Sam, who I used to do a wrestling podcast with, said, and we did a contract which said, if we are still mates in five years, we both get a tattoo that says Chatmax. And... Um, the five years par all the way through everyone was like ad won't do it ad won't do it ad won't do it and in my head i was like i'm gonna fucking do it because they all say i won't and sam was definitely gonna do it and then he's got a girlfriend now and he's like i and i'm i'm i know this seems like i'm blaming the girlfriend but he's like yeah i don't think um xxx is into tattoos so i don't i'm not i'm probably not gonna do it unbelievable Blake Town. It can happen. Taff, let's do it. But I, I even follow some tattoo artists on Instagram in, from, in Brighton. Um, and there are ones that I'd like to do. But like, yeah. I've just seen, like, I know people, I know family members who've got tattoos that were cool and then for whatever reason have become problematic, whether it's to do with cultural appropriation um, in fact, it's pretty much always to do with that, um, or whatever it may be. So yeah, I'd go pretty simple and basic. That's the worst excuse ever for not getting a foot tattoo. What Sam's? I was going to get it. Oh, for my excuse. Well, I don't need to get it now. If he doesn't get it, I'm not going to get it. And it's just going to say chat max on one of my toes. So I think maybe, but maybe when I go to the tattoo place, I think I might get, I might get that as well and then surprise everybody. Oh, Sam's excuse because he's got a girlfriend. Yeah. Just get cutter over the eyebrow. I, th I think I'm definitely going to do it because like, yeah, you only live once. Um, and then who knows? Maybe I'll get the bug. Um, here we go but I think loads of people have cool as fuck tattoos I think um, a la Llama's hand tattoos are very cool and I think ono.jpg you have sort of similar style hand tattoos they're very cool um, I won't start listing everybody's tattoos now because people will feel left out let's do the crossword I know, Pip. Um, we sort of agree it didn't have to be on the foot. It could be anywhere. But my plan was to get it on my toes. 68% have said no. 32% uh, have said yes. Your tiger sparkle muffin. I don't know if I've seen your tiger. Maybe I have. All right, freeze in the chat. Sam used to... So Sam was the person who also helped me with my opening video, did like the little animated bit. And uh, he used to be in the chat. When I first started streaming, he used to watch. Uh, but not anymore. Because he got a girlfriend. I don't know why he doesn't watch. Maybe he thinks I'm a prick. Here we go. Crossword time. Go. What? This has never happened. Uh, mini crossword. This, this is, we're not doing the New York Times one. Was I on the independent website then? 
No, let's try the independent one, which I think is the same one. It's taken from the same place. Let's see if this works. This is huge. Okay, freeze the chat again. Can you still see? Yeah, we've got good framing. Here we go. Yes, okay, X. Uh, newborn. Foal? Uh, why am I saying that? Baby? It's, it's not going to be baby. Baby's too... Why did I say foal first? Baby's too easy. Love in Leon. Don't know. France, F-R-A. No. 100 Copex. Don't know what that is. Express Contempt. Uh, anger. Baby, 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 baby. Gung ho. Gung ho is like can do, can do attitude it could be, or like a, um, you're going inside, I don't know. What. One learning the ropes, don't know, don't know, don't know. Slot machine symbol. Slot machine symbol. What do you have on slot machines? Don't know. Cause, cause to chuckle. Um, joke. Something that's funny, don't know. Initial Cub Scout rank. Ah. Oh. No idea. Memorial tribute. It's not going to be baby, is it? But I feel like baby's too easy. Nine, to and fro. Which is just F-R-O, isn't it? Send for consultation. Send for consultation. Don't know. We, we are absolutely fucked here. One, learning the ropes. Uh, one learning the ropes is the one like solo solo 10 across gung-ho oh, eight across ex express contempt S um scoff s-c-o-f-f -F. if you scoff at something are you expressing contempt 10 across gung-ho Let's think of this. Four down. Memorial tribute. I feel like baby is not going to be right. Memorial tribute. Mm. Six down. Send for consultation. What does that mean? Um, review. Send for consultation. None of these are good. Initial Cub Scout. We were talking about scouts earlier. Initial Cub Scout rank. What do you do to... I can't remember. I was never in the scouts. I went to um, Beavers once with my mate. Initial Cub Scout rank. This is a terrible one, everyone. Two down. Cause to chuckle. Is it Baby. Slot machine symbol. But bomb? I can't think of what they have on a slot machine. A start, like, coin? Uh, absolutely fucked it. Terrible crossword. Terrible performance, but I don't think it's easy. Will I complete the crossword in three minutes? No. Sorry, everybody. Let you all down there. Here we go. Bar. Oh, bar, like a gold bar. Oh, like that. Okay, slot machine is in. I'm. I was thinking of like symbols on the machine that sort of help identify what you need to do, not the actual things on the fruit machine. So you get the bars and the various other things. It is baby. Amore, and this is going to be amore, isn't it? Because it's French love, French for love. Seven across. Don't know. Two down. Cause to chuckle. Um. Amuse. This is going to be amuse. Oh, and Scoff was right. Three down. Initial Cub Scout. Bol. Boy. Boy Cub? That sounds really weird. But it could well be that, could it? No. 7A. Ruble. 100 Copex is a ruble, is it? Thank you, Sparkle Muffin. E-L. Bob. Bobcat. Is it Bobcat? What's this word? E Rio. Four down memorial. Well, oh, let's keep going down. Uh, yeah, love and Leon. I I'm, I'm sort of regret that. Three down is wolf. Uh, no. 
the Muse, we got it. Maybe I don't know what, what the initial Cub Scout rank is either. Sun's crying now, thanks. <laughs> Bobcat, such a weird thing. Boy Cub. Look, I thought you'd all have other answers. Armour. Oh, it's not a more, it's a more, a A-M-U. Ah, a more. So what's this then? Where do we do memorial tribute? Eulogy. E. U. L. O. G. Y. Babe. What's this though? Is a ruble spelled like that? Six down. Send for cut. Refer. Refer. That's fair. Okay. Ten across is eagle. Eager. Sorry. Yeah. And then eleven across. Tyro. One learning the ropes. Tyro. Never heard of that before. No worries. Spark spark on my fin. I got it wrong anyway. Tyro. Beginner or novice. Never heard of that. Oh, it's Greek mythology. No, of course I didn't. Person who follows a pursuit without attaining proficiency. Sounds like me with most games. In Greek mythology, an Elean princess who later became queen of Lolcus, <laughs> Aeolcus, Daughter of King Salamanius of Elis and Al Alcidice, Alcidice, Sam Alcidice. She married her uncle, King Critheus of... Just stop making up all these words that finish with E-U-S, is my advice. That's first things first. For me. Right, I've paid out. Have I paid out? Yeah. Let's do the swedle. Let's start with cunt, because that's what we do. Oh, okay, straight to cock. Yes! Oh, bad hand thing to do when you've just written out cock. Hello, Cudder. <laughs> straight to cock. Straight to cock. Here for the cock. Yes, Cudder, perfect timing. Welcome in, everyone. I can't believe we got cock. Zeus, Poseidon, Sam Allardyce, the Pantheon. Straight to cock. I'm well chuffed that cock came up. I should stop talking now. Too many clippable sound alerts. Let's have a look at the, see if the factual is any good for today. Rank the largest oil and gas companies by market cap. Fuck off. Absolutely no way. There will be no enjoyment in that. Factual sports. World's most valuable soccer clubs. Now, this is boring for almost all of you, but I'm going to do this. Um, PSG, Man City. I reckon Man United are probably up there. Uh, Real Madrid. And maybe Newcastle. Oh, they are, are they actually valuable yet? Uh, sorry, everybody. Let's just get this over and done with. Is Barcelona valuable? Let's put Barcelona in. Enter. Look at that. PSG not even on there. How did I not put Munich? Yeah, we don't know how, um, how the value works. Okay, so let's go. Man City, uh, Real Madrid, Manchester United, Barcelona, Bayern Munich. Enter. Shit. Okay, in that case, let's go. Real Madrid. Manchester United, Man City, another club, Chelsea, and then Barcelona. <gasps> Real Madrid, Manchester United, Barcelona, Man City, Liverpool. Real Madrid, Manchester United, Barcelona, Liverpool, Man City. There you go, everybody. 
that was good. I actually enjoyed that. I enjoyed that. Sorry if you didn't. Maybe, maybe this will make up for it. Let's look inside a house on Property Guesser. We'll guess what grass they have on Property Guesser. Is there going to be a cut chair on Property Guesser? All right, it's time for fun on Property Guesser. Is this the back garden already? No. Is this a massive front garden? John, a lot of people just hate football. A lot of people don't like football, and there are also a lot of reasons not to like football, especially modern day football. But um, so th that's why I don't bother, you know, bring it up occasionally, but we're never going to do exclusive chat, football chat streams. Uh, weirdly, though, when I was first thinking about streaming, when Pip started streaming and I was thinking about it, I wrote down all the things I could play, and Football Manager was on my list. I doubt I would have. Um, got very far because I don't even play that properly Sam's pissed you off now why because of the tattoo thing the proposal would change cuck chair to fuck chair just a chair for watching fucking and removes any perceived judgement and allows it to live on yeah we could do I just don't do that bet anymore. I think that's fine. I think, um, I think I'm going to leave it in the song and I think it's absolutely fine. And we can have a little um, nod and a smile when we see one, but I just won't do the bet. I just won't draw as much. I'm just not drawing as much attention to it. We've got the shower bet now. Um, it's all good. We live, we learn, we grow, we develop. Anyway, the bet that you really care about is will they have grass in the back garden? And I've got to write the answers out. Oh, sorry, what grass will they have? Oh no, look, they're coming up as auto. Real, fake astro, no grass at all. One minute, one minute on this house and I'll tell you where it is in a bit. Exactly, I know. Oi! Thank you, Mary. Um... Get your gambles in. Lovely lawn. I mean, this is very much real grass, so you'd think they're going to have real grass around the back as well. Maybe those sheep. Or are you just trying to make people bet against number one? No, you've backed three. Something makes me think all the grass is going to be in the front and none in the backs. Emily agrees. Plates, please. It does look like a nice house. Um, I'll tell you where it is in a minute. I'll tell you where it is right now. It's in Plymouth. Near Egg Buckland. How did this place end up being called Egg Buckland? Egg Buckland. Name, origin. Boshland is of Saxon origin and means royal land held by charter. The, do the Doomsday Book of 1086 recorded that his manor was held by the King William. Blah, 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 blah. That's not giving me any information. No, can't be, can't, can't, can't face reading all that. Anyway, Plymouth. I've been to Plymouth once, I think, in my life. Don't remember why, don't remember what I did. It's quite far away though, hard to get to. Eckers Bushland became Egg Buckland. Makes sense. I wasn't paying attention and just realised we're doing this house and now I regret my bet. <laughs> what did you do? Faker Astro. Look at this, beautiful. Um, let's look at the floor plan. I think we've got a, bal a, um, not a balcony, a bungalow on our hands. In we go. Sitting room, two bedrooms downstairs, kitchen diner. Big bathroom. Or is it just everything else is small? And then you've got an external garage and office. This is nice. Potential streaming room here. Get some info. Beautifully maintained level plot. Short walk to Crown Hill shops and bus routes. 
detached garage and garden office, two double bedrooms, modern shower room, kitchen diner, no one would change, PVCU, double glazing and gas central heating. Classic. Let's go in. Oh. Charming. Not much to talk about. I think you're right, sheep. I do feel like we've seen this kind of living room very often. Very comfy looking sofas and chairs, armchairs. Very brown window frames. That's their choice. Those, those are fairly new. If it's UPVC, although actually, when did UPVC double glazing become a thing? Probably like 40 years ago. Maybe 30. I've got no clue. I'm just making out numbers. Uh-oh. I think that might be the back garden. Look at that perfect lawn. It's patchy enough to know it's real grass. It is absolutely perfect, though. That's so nice. Beautiful blue skies. Lovely for a kickabout. So perfect that it could be. No. Really nice. That patio needs a bit of a pressure wash. Although I, we, we used to have this kind of, these kind of patio um, slabs. And they're the kind that you pressure wash and actually it all goes yellow and actually looks a bit shit and it's better to leave it weathered. That would be my advice to the, to the new owners of this lovely Plymouth property. Okay, here's the kitchen diner. It is actually just small. As in... The scaling, I thought it looked like it was going to be massive. It's not small, small, but um, it's definitely not massive. The time? Could be anything. Quarter past 12, or is it quarter past one? Or is it half past one? Is this the seconds? We've got a kettle. We've got, what's this, like an energy meter or a smart, or a, um, smart meter or a uh, thermostat? Really not much else going on. No messages about spaghetti. What's the point? Can we get a little close up and some more detail on this? No. What can we tell about the pin board? They've got a variety of different colors of pins. That's good. That shows personality. Still unsure of what the time is. Got a calendar. They're just leaving the kettle and the sponge, or is this just how they live? Very minimal living. Really, this is... Uh, I'm struggling to, to find anything to talk about here. Just, just nothing. This is just a nothing house. None of us will remember this. In years to come, when each of you are asked to list your favourite memories from Property Guesser um, for a uh, ad, ad ad celebration stream, that no doubt one of you will suggest we do um, at some point. Uh, none of you will remember this, which is why we need something shocking, like we need a corpse or something in the next room. No, no. Oh. Is this the office room? This is the room that they're proposing as an office. They've got a very nice... Um, I was about to call that a diaphragm. Um, what's this called? Rollator. Uh, it's a walking aid, but what do they... There's a name, Zimmer frame. Why did I think of diaphragm? But this one's got wheels on and, and brakes, which looks pretty cool. And maybe some other accessories, or are they just using it as shelves? Mids. Thank you very much for your question, Mids. What is your favorite property, or your best property guess of memory? Maybe the sheets, although I forgot what they said now. The, that, that when we went into that bedroom and they had those sheets, um, which had that text on, Oh God, now I've forgotten what it, what it is. And then Mary spent ages going through the website and finding loads of other sheets. They were funny. The sheets that said something about one of them being like a princess. 
It was just really, sh- like, really shit. Uh, and then we had another one where we found, like, in the bedroom, there was, like, a massive stain. The veterans, yeah. Yeah, I wish I could remember what it said now, Mids. It's not a great memory if I can't remember it. Anyway, massive lack of stuff in this place. Look, this is fine. This is nice. It's a nice sunny day, nice bright room. Although you've got the light on and the windows open or you don't need the light on. Again, nothing going on. Nice enough room. Uh, (laughs) Sorry, I've just seen the next question come in. Uh, Fine bathroom. Absolutely nothing to be said there. This is shit. Oh, well, hold on. I think that's fake grass. And I think this is the back garden. I don't think that's real, Slothy. We'll get back to this in a moment. Scooby Spit, thank you so much for your question. Welcome along to the AMA. Thank you for taking the opportunity to ask me a question at this time. How great is lemon as a flavour? I'm not going to lie. Probably my favourite flavour. If I go for any sweet treats like or desserts if there's a lemon option i want it biscuits cake pies anything you can get in lemon yogurt i love really really good well done well done well done for noticing um is this a bet gate cutters excited look how perfect this is the reason why i'm pretty sure that this is fake grass is because there are no signs of any blades of grass coming up over the edge. The colour is too consistent. If we come back to... here, that is patchier. You can see little divots and things like that, little a little uh, yellowy bits. I believe this is the front of the house. Let's go back to the picture. There you go. It is. This is the front of the house. There's the patio. There's that ball tree there. And then we come back over here. Patio, ball tree, another tree. Front of the house. Guaranteed this is the front of the house. I know that because that is the front door. And there is a fence. Come to the back garden. Fence that we saw from out there, the front of the house. Front door is here. Here is the back area. You've got the hose in the back. You never have the hose out the front. This is the back garden. And this is fake grass. And I cannot believe this because this is huge for whoever backed fake. There is no grass coming over here. Whereas if we go back to this, you can see little bits Kestrel, you can see, bear with me, little bits of grass coming up over the side here. It is also patchy. Let's just close down all other photos that don't matter. Uh, Online Photoshop. What's it called? Photo P. Here we go. New project. What? Fine, we'll go with this. Why is this an option? What is happening here? Copy image. Paste image. Copy image. Paste image. Taken on the same day. Don't forget. I mean, we don't know that for sure. Look at the different colorings. Let's compare. Are we, am I on the right scene? Yeah. A square of grass from here. Oh my God, I hate doing this not on my normal computer. And then let's delete that layer. Is that gone? I do not know what this is. What is this? Deselect. And then let's paste. Look at the difference. Look how patchy. That is it. And that's the back garden. I don't give a fuck. 
there's no there's no convincing me. The one person who voted for fake Astro, it has helped. That's not grass cutter. Fish, was it you? It was you, wasn't it? Get ready. I don't know how many points you're going to get here. But 60 grand went on real and 11 grand went on no grass at all. Choose outcome. Fake Astro. Slothy. Please, Slothy. I know you're a good, good person. You have integrity. You know that's not real grass. Look, it looks exactly the same in the shade. Usually you'd have patchy bits in the shade. You have 9k right now. I'm a shit cunt and I'll die on this hill. Is there anyone who didn't bet? Is there anyone who didn't bet who would like to give an opinion? Which I might take up. Basically, if it agrees with, if you agree with me, it's fake. That's real grass. I've been there. I've sat on it. Seriously, Tarantula Lansbury, that's crazy coincidence. Cuddle, what do you think? Fake, fake. It is fake. If he dies, he dies. <laughs> As a non better and fake grass ever, that's defo fake. Yes, Taff Man. If I speak, I'm in trouble, Cudder. Uh, but we're going to go with the people who... Look, there's a lot of people there who, who think that's fake, who didn't bet. No skin in the game. Fake slash Astro. Complete. How are you doing now? How are you doing now, Fish? You had 9K. 80K. You just got 71K. Well, basically 70... Nearly... Yeah. Fake grass if I've ever seen it, which I have. Barma, thank you so much. That's good. Maybe we will remember this house now. I was saying we won't remember when we do the This Is Your Lifestyle um, celebration of ad stream, which is coming up soon if anybody wants to arrange it. This house might be remembered when we do the highlights of Property Guesser. Thank you, Fish. Thanks, community. This is worse than when Daitai did us all in. Um, that was Property Guesser. That was cool. Enjoyed that. Price. Fuck. I always forget. Because that's the least important thing. We will go back though. Let's go back and find out. Uh, Plymouth. How much are we thinking? Who wants to guess? Did we even see all the photos? Good point. We got to the back garden here and we... Oh my God. Why didn't I just go here? <laughs> Imagine. Why didn't I just go here? Look how fake this is. Look how fake this is. Look. There's no grass sitting up at the side. Further evidence. One location per day. Playtown, you're right. Look how fake it is. Unbelievable. I reckon it's because they get shade here all the time and this bit, that's, uh, my, my garden's like this. Some of it is in shade all the time and the grass doesn't grow. Um, that looks very tidy. Imagine if it was like an extreme close-up. Look at that. That's what you need. The, patch of the patchiness of the real grass against the perfection of the fake. No fish. And then the final photo, I love it if it's a sign of a, of a gardener saying with a sign that says, this is fake grass. It, it is not. How much should we say? 380, 425, 400, 200. This is all the way down in Plymouth and it's only a two bed bungalow. So those seem like quite expensive guesses. 200k. I'm going to go for Sparkle Muffins 200k and then we can both be wrong together. Actually, I'm going to put this mostly on Sparkle if it's wrong. It's fuck's sake, Sparkle. Of course it's more than that. 340. Who, who said around there? Oh no, said 425. Yeah. 
Should have trusted the person who's currently in the middle of a uh, house purchase. You probably didn't want me to bring that up, oh no, but I hope it's all progressing. That's a lot of money. One thing we never really know is how nice the area is. It could be really lovely. Okay, sorry, oh no. Hmm. Oh, and sparkle. Sorry to anybody who's trying to sell a house right now or buy a house. It's that top notch Astro. All right. Let's play the forest. Looking for a new roof. I think we're going to try and move house next year. Next year, we will have been in this house for 10 years. And that is wild to me. That is... Uh... I'm trying to think. What's the longest I've ever spent in a house? I think I lived in one house for like two years when I was a baby. Then we moved and I lived in a house for about five years. Then we moved and I lived in a house from seven until 18. So that's 11 years. And then I basically moved every year until 10 years ago. Um, or nine years ago. So next year I think we're going to move which could completely change. I reckon when we move, we're going to look for a house that has an extra room, which means that my streaming room will be in the house. That might change completely how I go about streaming. There'll be no more shouting. I might have to be quiet. I might have to be like Limmy late night streams. We'll see. So here we go. If you missed the last two forest streams, survival horror, um, where I'm having to sort of craft stuff and upgrade stuff and slowly working out the mechanics. Um, Slothy, I drove past my childhood home the other day and it looked shite. They paved over the front garden, the animals. Uh, now I know why you're so bitter about gardens. Um, we're working out that if I've got a fire, then the bad people sort of run towards me, but then back off. Um, I haven't worked out much more. I now know how to get water, but the main issue we have is this. My last save was from 8.27 p.m. last night, and I actually stopped playing at 9.45 and died, so we lost an hour and a quarter. But it doesn't matter. Yes, yes, Aiden. Good one, John. I'm slowly getting used to the game, even though I've already played it for 3.9 hours. That's true, Blade Town, but that's okay if I'm dead. Hello, anybody who's coming after watching. Um... Limmy? Good timing. Just getting back into the game. So, I think, let's have a look at what I've got. Do I have a, do I have a fire here? Oh, I thought I was picking up loads of rocks then, but I wasn't. So there's my thing of water. Why can't I pick that up? I've already got one. Ah. Okay, so can I fill up from here? No, some place, yes. Honestly, that's sound. I know, I'm just, I'm really sorry. If Llama was here, they'd be telling me just to turn the, the music down or turn those sounds down. So maybe I'll actually just do that. Where's the audio? So yeah, chill out. Turn the sound effects down a little bit. 
Hello, Brian. Beef adjusted. Okay. Uh... Don't need to pick up another pot. So I think what I might do is just go home and try and find more rope. I've got three rope. I need seven to build a boat. Let's just head home. Let's just head home. What should I eat before I go? Let's kill some fish. <laughs> so shit when you miss. Might as well kill all of these, right? Fuck. Uh, we, we could do a gamble about, like, will I die in the next 10 minutes? Or will I die before nightfall? Oh, God, no. It's, it's, it's going to be nightfall. I should make a spear, shouldn't I? Can't carry any more fish. Three fish is the max. Right, let's head let's head towards home. I'll make a spear in a bit. In fact, shall I just make one now? Where's weapons? Traps of defense? How do you make a spear? Thank you. 245, thank you very much. Thank you, Mary and um, Sparkles. I messaged Sparkle Muffin last night. Boy! Straight after I did the raid, because last night, John Atfield Art and Sparkle Muffin were both streaming when I finished, and they're two people who... Uh, pretty much never streaming when I finish and I didn't know who to raid and then I ended up raiding John because John had fewer viewers and uh, message Sparkle after and went just so you know I'm not carrying on the bit about never watching your streams god let's get home I just remember like when I first started streaming I remember there'd be times when I was trying to boost my numbers and I remember occasionally somebody would be streaming and I'd be like oh oh maybe they'll raid me not saying that you would have thought like that you probably don't think about that stuff but um yeah here we are can I go to bed not yet okay so let's save uh, there. So dark, isn't it? There are options to change it so it's not quite as dark, which I think I'm not too worried about myself, but it might be better for the stream. Caves and night brightness. Look, it's right at the bottom. Shall I just, should we try it? There you go. That, I mean, that is kind of hardly any better at all but it's a little bit better um i need to make a fire i'd like to remember what the key bind is to open up my book survival guide b right instead of pressing i all the time let's do a fire should i do a fire pit we did that before should i do a bonfire Let's just do a basic fire. Basic fire. Still quite loud, but not too bad. Light it. Uh, let's get the water on there. Let's cook the iguana or whatever it is. Can you put fish in at the same time? No, let's leave it. Let's turn off the light and then let's just chill by the fire. 
Look at this. Love to eat that. Don't know if I'd boil it like that with just the head in the water. Don't know if that's necessarily the best way. Yes, Sloffy. I remember, like, in Sons of the Forest 2, the inventory looks fucking amazing. Let's just take a moment to look at how good that is. Sons... Oh, sorry, Sons of Forest, so it's not the Forest 2, but it is like a sequel, isn't it? Sons of the Forest Inventory. Just in case people haven't seen it. Look at that. You like roll open your bag and you've got all this stuff. I don't want to see. I feel like I'm getting spoilers there. Look at this. Looks so good. Anyway, I've eaten. Let's pick that up, put that away. I'm just going to leave the fire. And I'm going to press B. And I'm going to look at my house situation. I want to build a log cabin. I need 82. Maybe just a small cabin then. No, let's go big. 82 logs. Do you remember I had all those logs here? Before I died. Actually, let's, what happens if I press 1? There you go. What's in 2? 3, 4, 5... What am I drinking when I press that? Okay, it doesn't matter. Let's chop down some logs. Did it? It did say 82, didn't it? Do we just get 13? Okay, here's, here's another question. Let's look at more storage. Because if I'm going to try and get a load of logs. Log holder. 16 sticks. How, how many sticks have we got? Six. Okay, let's go get some more sticks. This is fine. Can't actually see where the trees are. Let's press L for the lighter. Get some sticks. This is fun. Too many sticks. Okay, let's do a log holder. Maybe we do stay around here. I'm starting to fall in love with my little area here. So let's get a log a log holder over here. Exactly, Taff. I don't need to pick up my my child. Uh, rotate. Oh, well, that looks shit. C. B. Log holder. Uh, put it over here, then. Just put it next to this. Sixteen required. I've got stick. I've got sticks here. E e e e. E e e e e e e. Two more. Two more. Hello, sparkles. How are you doing? Have you played uh, this Sons of the Forest then fish? More sticks. It's going pretty well. Well, I mean, is it? If anybody who's played the game before can be the judge of that. It's probably not going very well at all. Okay, so that's definitely enough sticks. Am I picking up leaves all the time? Yeah, I've got shit loads. Okay, that's good. Could be better, could be worse. I'll take that.
E, E, E. Okay, oof. There we go. We're ready for logs. Should we go and chop some logs? Any more stuff over here I've never picked up? Cash. Should we chop this up now? Am I actually doing anything here? Oh. Do I need this? You can probably get like a trophy shelf, can't you? That's good though. That's going to scare some... It's not going to scare anybody off, is it? I don't think those people who are trying to get me are going to get scared. Money. Booze. Money and booze. What else do you need in life? Hello, Div. Happy Pride. Happy Tuesday. My niece leaves today. She goes to London tonight and then she's flying to Scotland tomorrow. Um, my Australian niece has been staying with us for four nights. It's been really lovely. But when she goes, we will finally be through our five weeks of it just crazy busyness and back-to-back -back plans trips to Ireland, festivals, charity walks, all accompanied by loads of illness. Uh, and finally, this weekend, I have a completely free weekend. Um, we're not going to do anything. I mean, we, you know, we'll go out and about. Thank you, Sparkles. I didn't read it. Uh, I'm very excited. Yeah, she's going up to um, Milnathort, which I think is not that far away from Edinburgh. Uh, does that ring any bells to anybody? It's where her grandmother lives, um, on the other side of the family. I'm going to actually look at this right now. Where is Milnathort? I think I stayed there and we walked to Tea in the Park. When I went to Tea in the Park... Here we go. Kim Ross. Yeah, that rings a bell. And where is um, Tea in the Park held? Because we stayed at somebody's house around here. And... Uh, oh, right. Okay. You have to cross over. Tea in the Park was next to Milnathorpe Palado. Right. Perfect. Yeah, so we, we could walk. We stayed there and we walked to the festival. That was like one of my first experiences. I went, that was when I was like 16. I went with my brother and his wife because his wife's uh, family are all from Milner Thor and Kinross. And uh, we went to Tea in the Park and it was one of my first experiences of being in Scotland. In fact, it might even be the first time I've been to Scotland. Um, everyone called me big man. I loved it. I was 16. I wasn't a very big man. I remember drinking loads of tenants watching I, kind of, I remember watching the streets at Tea in the Park I cannot remember what else I watched who else I watched don't think I got a square sausage maybe I did yeah she's getting the train up there to spend some time with her grandmother but honestly <clears throat> Hannah has been ill the whole time and uh, we're just like it's going to be so good not to have any plans we've got two weekends in a row without any plans so we can just do what we want the three of us I should be around for TPI on fr Friday on Friday if if, uh, if it's going ahead which I imagine it is should be around for Cudder stream on Saturday <sighs> I think ugh <sighs> Sorry for yawning when I talked about Cudder. Yeah, we will. We'll get up on Saturday morning and be like, right, what are we doing? But there's no plans, you know, like there's nowhere we need to be at any time. We've got nobody coming to visit or stay. We're not staying anywhere. Don't have to pack any bags.
after five weekends in a row of uh, lots of social stuff and it's gonna be great what's going on why isn't this falling down yes sparkles i'd love that you get hungry really quick in this or it seems really quick two logs i think quite often more than two full but Maybe I can go to sleep in a minute as well. I wonder if I'm tired enough. How do I know if I'm tired enough? Come on. See, see. I can sleep. Let's sleep and then it'll be the morning and then we'll be able to see better and we'll just do a load of tree getting. Or should I be trying to do missions and explore? I, I really don't know. that it's a bit of old tree getting trees is the best part isn't it Taff. our friends best friends hello gamer girl 8147 how you doing thank you for coming in thanks for the follow playing the forest as you can see I'm about four hours in but in reality I'm about an hour in or maybe an hour and a bit, because I've died, I've lost saves. It's all gone fairly badly. Get well, thank you. The only problem is my base is right near, like, spawn, or right near where I landed, so I don't know if that's good. But I quite like having the option to go in the water. Okay, Taff. <laughs> What's happened? Yeah, look, there's another log there. Okay, I'll come and collect the loose logs in a second. You just loaded out FM24. Uh-oh. Who are you going to be? I've made the mistake of starting to play Football Manager again for the first time since before I started streaming. I'm Brighton and Hove Albion. Log. Log. There's another log there. We're going to get this... Eight, well, 80 logs is quite a lot of logs, isn't it? Look, there's more logs over here. Fucking yes. Yeah, I think I cannot be bothered to build anywhere else now, basically. I think to try and up sticks, like literally take everything somewhere else. I can't. I just can't. Right, let's get... Whoa. <laughs> I'll just be Brian then. I think it does seem all right, Mary. I think it's quite nice. Have I got to... Oh, am I full of sticks already? What does combine mean? Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. Right. Uh, let's pick up some of the spare logs. Where were those other logs? I've lost my bearings. Oh, there's definitely ones down here on the beach, weren't there? Whoa, I've totally lost my bearings. Pick up these, put my stick into stick storage. And... Um, oh, I've just got to drop these on the floor. And then get some more sticks. Actually... 
What do I need for uh, log storage? 16. Okay, so I haven't got enough. Okay, let's go get some sticks. This is good news, the rain, because it's going in my catcher and then I'll be able to boil it. And look how hungry I am. Should really cook a fish rather than eating the snacks. But... Fuck it. Log. Actually, let's drop that. Let's hit some, get some sticks. Drop that. Hit some sticks. No. Stop picking that up. Get some sticks before we do anything else. I like getting the sticks. That's satisfying. I would say that not much of this like gathering is as satisfying as rust. But I like getting the sticks. But in terms of like chopping down a tree or picking out rocks, it's nowhere near as satisfying. Two weeks, Div. Always two weeks. New server coming in two weeks. I'm worried. I don't know who's going to start a new Rust server. Because Paige has basically said that they're not going to do it. So I think that means we're fucked, everyone. Okay. Log holder. Let's get another log holder here. And then E, 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 E. E E E E E E E E E E E E E E E E E E Fucking yes E E C C E E C C This is satisfying E Why does it not let me pick it up? C Look at that Surely Pip has time. Imagine if Pip was like, on second thoughts, removes the, the Kickstarter. I'm going to start a Rust server. Barmer. Actually, we did have that little idea, Barmer, or you had the idea and I thought it was good of like a little collaboration, but I just don't think it's a good idea for us to do that. I definitely, like I try and play football most Thursdays, so I'm going to be no good when it's time to do the wipe and reset the map and all that stuff. Yes, Taff. Yeah, I think you're right, Bomber. Maybe 10.30 will do it at some point, but everybody knows 10.30 shouldn't get involved in Rust. Okay, so how many of these have I got? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and I need 80-something. No. I'm going to do the small shack, aren't I? How much was the small shack? 13. I could do one now. <gasps> I could pretty much do one now. That doesn't look very big. Right, where should we actually have the hut? Where's the door? It's a bit shit you don't know where the door is. I can see the window at the front there. Is that too small? Shall I just not do it? I'm happy to have some back seating if people want to say. <laughs> do you think it's actually better for me to save up and get the big one? Maybe I should play it off stream for a bit and get, um, yeah, I should just, small things can still be worth doing. Oi, 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 Mary. Um, I'd like to apologize once again. 80 logs isn't that many. Thank you for making my decision for me. I do need to eat. So let's, um. Let's um, 
drink seawater? No, I need this. Can I get the water there? Yeah. Fucking hell. Let's light this. Let's get this on here. Let's get a fish in there. And then, in fact, while that's cooking, let's chop down a couple of trees. A lot of us have watched full three hour streams of Pip chopping down trees. So I reckon I can get, I can, I can do this. That's what I miss as well. I, I want to watch some Pip streams of Rust of some, whatever the, like the big crazy project that he picks to do is. I want to watch B. Dolan going from strength to strength. Picking up tips, learning. I want to shoot Llama in the head. And Kada. <laughs> Never playing Rust again. I suppose if you... Uh, if and when you get the funding for your film, that'll be you out. I think most everybody should stop you from ever playing Rust. Also, I guess B. Donan can't really play Rust this year because got quite a lot going on as well. But that's quite boring though, isn't it? Focusing on your real life priorities and passions. Disgusting. I don't need to store it, but I like it to be tidy. Just make the film in Rust. Yeah. 1030's got experience. Dando likes Rust. Marilyn likes Rust. Cade likes Rust. Vowed that my last Rust drama was my last Rust drama. That is very noble and strong-headed and annoying. Probably the right thing. Knowing that you can only carry two of these at a time, right? Do you think I should be doing this? Just drop them there and then we'll do shuttle runs in a bit. Is that quicker? Or is it exactly the same amount of time? <laughs> oh, Sparkle Muffin, wow. No, I haven't get well. I actually haven't. I don't really understand that. I don't know what you, what my options are. So, it. Oh, chill out. Oh, I didn't need to be that loud. Is it? Is it stuff in here? Crafting to craft an item, you need to collect the required amount of resources. You can. You can view recipes by hovering over the cog after adding an item. Right. So, for example, if I put this on here. No. If I put, can I make this better? Ah. Damage plus speed weapon. How do I choose that? Tooth. How do I select this? Look, when I go over to it. Is that the sap? Should I do this? Looks exactly the same. Oh, the sled. Try to put a stick in there and see what it suggests. Is this how we're going to get a... Um... No. Right click, not left click. 
Here we go. Arrows. How do you select the thing though? I'm quite annoyed that I can't select what I want to make here. It doesn't. I, I just have to follow the recipe. But how do I make a bow? Basically, why can't it be like rust exactly? To get all the stuff, manually add it. Okay. The other tabs in your book have other items you can build and one is a sled which helps a lot with logs. Okay. Thank you. I should also eat some food. My fish! That was good, though. Let me carry these back and uh, go and eat my fish. It's going to be fish soup right now, which isn't the worst outcome. My fish! What's going on here? Why do I have two of these and why are they sunk into the ground and where's my fish? Somebody else come and done some cooking. The lizard skin. Right, I'm going to learn loads of stuff now. I'm going to shove loads of stuff onto that bit of the mat. Bring some of your other stuff onto the crafting mat to see what you could make. Am I living... No, this is useful. This is useful. Just remember, I'm not as not like a natural... I don't have gamer instincts a lot of the time. So li little nudges in the right direction like this is totally fine by me. I'm a bit annoyed about this situation with my fucking fish and water. And now I've got no water in there. I'm going to I'm gonna have to eat one of these. Go into the inventory and just hover over the lids of skin and see what it says. Increases armor. And now I've clicked on it. <gasps> Badass glove thing. That's great. Chainsaw with light. Oh, I have to find a chainsaw. How do I craft a bow? Surely that's going to be string or something like that. What can I make with these? Slingshot. Okay, this is exciting. What do I do with the booze? Molotov. Makes sense. When I suppose there is a time I might need a Molotov. Should we make one now? Yes. So that's good when I've got groups. Ah, because I can chat that on the floor and they don't like fire. So that would be handy to have whenever I'm walking around, I suppose. Uh, should we make... I've got quite a lot of booze, so let's make two of those. Oh, shit. <gasps> Please don't actually light it. Okay. Tempting to practice, but... How many of these have I got? I've got 54 cloth! Let's make four Molotovs. Yes. What can I make with my watch? Oh, do you remember I found all those other watches last night? And... Explosive. Okay. Cassettes. What do I make here? Oh, just puts... Was that just put the cassette in? Remove. Equip? We did this the other day, didn't we? I feel like this will maybe attract people. Okay, what else can we do with, with rope? Water skin? Snowshoes, quiver. Ah, oh, how do I make a bow? I want to know how to make a bow. Uh, still not sure about the backpack. What can I do with air canisters? 
Refills, rebreather, nothing. Nothing at the minute. Total show we know about. That's all I've got. Tape. Slingshot. Crafted bow. Oh, sorry. So I already need to have the crafted bow. But I could make a slingshot now. I don't know why I need a slingshot. I suppose for killing like rabbits and stuff. Should we make a slingshot then? Stick, cloth, tape. So tape, cloth, stick. Fucking yes. And then I've got some little rocks. Let's equip. This is this is so good. Right. What do we do? It's no like reticule. Uh let's hit the cross. Not bad. I was going for speed. I'll pick up my stone. Now let's go for accuracy. What am I aiming? Is it there in the middle? Try and stick rope. Try stick and rope and see if it suggests bow. I genuinely can't remember how to make one. Uh, that would kind of make sense, wouldn't it? Stick, rope. Oh, look. And cloth. Yes! This is great. I'm now... I wish I hadn't made the slingshot now. It feels like a waste. Now I've got an arrow. So how do I make arrows again? Removal. Do that again. Five le Oh, feathers. It's feathers. Rival game and feathers I don't have yet do I because of the bird situation I've promised I've promised Llama I wouldn't kill any birds but can I just hit a oh no can I pluck a bird Slim or you mate well, Llama said that there are other ways to get feathers. So I feel I'm happy to, to know them. I'm a bit worried about the food situation. Yeah, I want info. Please, Tapman. Please, 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 please. Let's, let's put that in there. I know. Oh, God. I know, I've got two pots. I think what we're learning is I just need to go out and I need to get water and I need to find animals. I did, John. When you make your house, you can get a little birdhouse when you have your log house and they'll come nest. That's cool. But let's get some sticks. But I want to remember the quickest way to get water around where I live. I think there's a pond, like, just here. That was a bad one. Had lots of skulls on. Look at this, more pots. Shame you can't carry more than one pot. <gasps> they are quite scary, the way they're just always sprinting. Little rabbit then, as well. Water? Yeah. Fish. There's fish and water here. So. I thought I made this into a better axe. Where are the teeth? Let's try this again. Burning weapon, poison weapon. Okay, I did make it better. Add more teeth? Ah, maybe I didn't have enough teeth. Okay, fine. Oh my god, there's so much scope to this now. OK, 
Okay. Now, I'm quite intrigued as to whether I can just drink that. Boil it and drink it. Oops. Look at all the feathers. Can I just drink some of this? I can't remember what happens. Let's do it. Don't need to boil it, do I? Unless it's... um. This counts as fresh water. Add teeth to the shopping list. All right, well, this is good to know this water is here. Can you, you don't have a map, do you? So, as long as you're clean. It'd be nice to mark this on a map. Why aren't, why aren't I filling up? Why is it making me feel sick? You can mark it. Right clicking as if I'm trying to mark on uh, PUBG. Is it on my... Do you mark stuff on here? Okay. Let's not worry about it. Build a new signal, never give up hope. I'm not going to do that yet. I might never do that. How do you do a marker? Do you mind? Does anyone mind telling me that? Oh, look. I didn't notice these extra tabs. Oh, my God. <gasps> Rock Path Alpine Treehouse Tree Bridge I'm going to have to play this for so long to get to this level any of these levels Defensive walls. Infinite logs. That's good. You went past marker. Did I? Sorry. Where was it? Marker. Was it? Uh, I have no idea when you said that. Whereabouts was it? Is it here? In utilities. What's you, which one's utilities? Furniture, boats, signals, to do, stats, crafting, basics, fire, shelters, food, storage, building, furniture, traps, boats, signals, to do, stats, crafting, nature. I was in utility top left with was stick marker, light blue. Is this light blue? Is that light blue? I mean, that's... They're both light blue. Here? Stick marker! Two sticks, two rocks, two cloth. Now that's a little flag, is it, that I see? Yeah. That's really cool. Thanks, everyone. Shit. It's making me realise just how much there is to this game now. Never going to be able to play enough hours of this. I've got Disco Elysium to play at some point, and I've started playing Football Manager again. I need to I need to not be doing this. I'm just going to knock knock down a tree before we go back.
Before we go back properly, let's hit a tree down. Yeah, Mac. I could see... Is this getting knocked down? Yeah. Because even, like... There's so much to do. But, like, with Rust, you're usually with pals. Or there's people to talk to. Or there's little missions you can go on together. I can see that being a lot more fun. If you're doing, doing multiplayer. I'm into it, but it's just that, like, it's quite daunting knowing how much there is to do, or I could do. Yeah, yeah I mean, I'm, I'm nowhere near collecting 80 of these, for starters. Can I sleep? Shit. Right, I've got water now, though. So at least I can light the fire. And I can uh, polluted water equip. Oh, polluted. Did I just drink it? I just fucking drank it. Did I? Maybe not. I've just... What have I just done? Why are there three pots now? Did the fire die? Because I didn't put any fuel on it. Why are the pots multiplying? I'm going to die. I'm cold and wet. Chill. Let's just chill for a bit. Let's press B. Make a fire. Make a new fire. Light the fire. No! Stop dropping pots! And now I've got no water. And it won't let me even pick up a pot. <laughs> Fucking pots. All right, I've got a pot there. Let's go. We know where the water is because we've got a little marker, which is really cool. Let's just get some water. Why are they doing that? We'll get some water and it will be fine. I... We need teeth anyway. Why don't I save? Such a good idea. Just get my breath back. A bit of sprinting. I'm going to make it so I don't get too breathy. Oh! I think I found the water. Fill up. Again, I felt like I was just getting shot. Or, um, crossbowed. You've requested two saves, sheep. Sorry. Sorry anybody who's writing useful stuff and I'm missing it. I'm not choosing to. Let's all have a drink in real life. I said I was going to try not to get breathy and I failed. Chill out, logs. I've ne I haven't picked up three pots. I don't know why I've suddenly got three pots. Uh, where are all my fish? I thought I had one more fish. I've actually got nothing to cook. Right. Okay. My prioritize. Prioritize. My priorities are, ch are constantly changing. I now really need to go and catch some food does a cooked fish turn into a pot it certainly seems that way <laughs> I'm by a fire what the fuck 
I didn't save! It's fine though. Why? I thought they didn't light fires. Yeah, this is fine. I've done this before. But I thought they didn't light fires. You think you've learned something. And then it turns out it's not actually accurate. Oh yeah, we need to pay out the bet. I didn't die. And now I can get some more rope. And I remember the way out is here. Last time I went... In deep into the caves trying to go out and it's right here <sighs> yeah Mac I do and will I feel stupid here we go right we're not going to hang out here for too long but we're going to get a few bits and bobs I desperately need to eat Oh, I should have just pressed E. I need to eat. Every evening that passes, the games get harder and the bad guys get worse and more forward. Oh, why? But what about, so what? So the fire thing's not a thing anymore. So I really need to build my house and just be in the house at night. And now I'm all covered in blood. It's probably my blood though. Okay, let's hit a few of these. Right, okay. Thank you, Mac. That's good. That's a good thing to know. I suppose back in the old days, you'd buy a computer game and you'd read the manual. You'd found out. You'd find out what the game's about, what 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 the aim of the game is, any backstory. And pretty much all the time when I play games on stream, I just download it and press play. Like. Like, on the back of this game, it might have said, and every night it gets harder. So use your skills to build a house. I mean, yeah. They don't tell you. Okay. So much breathing. Right. We're going to go soon. I'd like him. Mm. Beer? Soda. These places are great. Why am I doing that with my hand? I'm so nearly dead. I know you've all told me to eat. <laughs> yes. Man, let's have a little granola and a can of lemonade. Dynamite? That's fucking cool. Let's get some flares. I should probably go. This is a good haul. I need to go. Circuit board? Yeah, more things that I could craft. I'm going to go now. I'm just going to go. I'll go back there again. There's no doubt I'll go there again. We were 20 days in and hadn't gone in a cave and our friend joined the server, saw the days that had passed and immediately said, you lads are fucked and logged out. <laughs> what day am I on? I think I'm on day three, maybe day four. Three or four. Oh, really? No, get away all... So now it makes sense why you start building the external walls and why you might need a team of people. This would be really fun with a team, actually. Forest co-op is great, huh? I know, I was just thinking, fuck it, that would be really cool. Do you see that thing over there? It just moved. Should I get the rope while I'm here, or should I not be doing this? I feel like I need to get back and save. I can't carry any more rope. Let's go. 
maybe we get some water though while I'm here. Nope, my pot's not here. Because Mr. Three Pots can't carry more than one at a time. Thank you, get a whale. Yeah, the traps. If this is a thing. I'm like, yeah, yeah, actually, I should put down some traps. But I'm in the middle of doing like four or five different things. Right. Hi, guys. Well, that was pretty useless. Chamomile tea. What have I brought back with me? Food. I really need to get food. Three sticks. Four dynamite. I've already got a spear. Look. I made that really early, I've just remembered. I could have used that to get fish. Let's go and get some fish. So that we're not going to die from hunger. And then we'll chop down some trees. Save. Pete, you're so right about the save. Exactly what I was going to do. Thank you. Um, so Matt, could people join this game? In theory. Yeah, just get three labourers. And we want to work and just join the game and just literally just be my henchman. But do not talk to me. There you go, Pete. Relax. Saved. Let's go get some food. Got a spear now. Will this let me get fish quicker? We know there are fish in this water up here. Yeah, I probably won't do that, Matt, because it'll be like awkward trying to get people for when I want to play it. But if I ever did another playthrough. Yes! Oh, too deep. That is fun. Yes. How many can I get? As maybe we maybe it maybe yeah. I know um, Llama and uh, Taff are thinking of doing Sons of the Forest at some point. I think. I think they were going to be doing it, or at least Taff's definitely going to play it at some point. Oh my god! I feel like you're like a one of the top level gamers. As. Can't carry more fish. It literally says it. Is that all you're allowed to carry? Three fish. Look at all this space. Okay, that's good to know. Oh, well, maybe we do do that. But because um, Llama and Taffa talked about playing that, I'll let them uh, get to it first, maybe. See how they get on. Right, heading back with the fish. No distractions. Maybe another pot? Grab it! Oh my god! Come here, you shit! No distractions, he says. I'm now chasing the rabbit. No, no, no. Let's go home. Rabbit would have been nice. I've got fish for dinner. I could have done the slingshot there, but as if I'm going to hit that. Are you serious? Did I not fill? I didn't fill my pot with water, did I? I, I could just kick a. F I could just cook a fish though. I don't. It doesn't need to be boiled. Is that right? Yeah. Right, here's a question. Right. How do I 
choose what is in my backpack. No. How do I choose what is in my quick select? Because at the minute, it's axe, soda, meds, booze. And I'd like to have axe, slingshot. So combine. 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 Okay, here we go. Press buttons to assign hotkey selection. Uh, instead of booze, then, maybe. Four. G. We did it. I'd like to change the order of those, but I can't be bothered. That's going to be a bit tricky. Uh, anything else we haven't looked at here? What can we do with coins? Explosives. I've got some meds, so that's good. Eat the fish. They're not cooked yet. Catch it. I'm on fire. I wanted to catch that. For fuck's sake. Catch it. Oh my god. Ah! Uh, oh. That was close. Catch it. Ah! Oh. <laughs> That's where I fall off a cliff doing this. Catch it. One more go. I collected it. I caught it. Right, let's eat a fish. God, that looks awful. Um, let's go get... Can I store fish? Right, what's the, what's the situation with food storage? Oh, there's too many options in this game. Storage. Can I store food? Explosive, cabinet... Um, anybody who's played this game before, can I store, like, fish? Any, or do I... Like, what's what's the deal? What's the deal with fish? There's a tab to the f left that looked like a fish. Oops. Hello, Daitai. Can hang up meat and such. Let's do a drying rat then. Let's do a drying rat here. Not enough sticks. Just honestly, um, it's endless little... Now my fire's dead. I need to write down all the stuff I've got to do. No, sticks. Get sticks first. Sticks, then fish and water. I think I might actually end up stop, stopping playing this um, because it's going to become too overwhelming. Like how much, like the endless scope and knowing that I'm just never going to be able to get around to doing it all. I feel, I've just felt that pang. I think that's in my future. <laughs> I'll just watch a playthrough online. Look at all these logs here. I know. This is why having a team would be great. I'd be like, right, you. You focus on hunting and gathering, like getting food sources. You focus on all these logs. 
Right. So I'll put the fish on here. Yes. Yes. Okay, that's good. Because now I can go and get three more fish. And some water. Wish I could carry two pole uh, pans. Let's equip the spear. Let's go. Yeah, Matt. The good thing about Rust, I guess. Oh, I, don't, I don't need to. I don't need to defend Rust here. I think the main thing about Rust is that it's a server full of people, and, and um, all of my experience is that it's been a server full of a lot of my mates. So it's just really fucking fun. Are there even any fish left? There's one. Shit. So fish won't just respawn for me. I'm not going to need to learn how to get fish to mate, am I? No. Can I pick up those leaves? No. Get those fish. Oh, that does look like there's more fish than there were. It's only so deep I can go. Maybe I need to craft some waders. Oh, come here. Yeah. Two weeks. Can't carry any more fish, but I can get some water. And I will. It is div. Two weeks of like a fortnight will fly by. Lol. In fact, let's get some more sticks while we're here. Well, you could argue it's logs I need. I'll, I'll get both. Can't carry any more sticks. Let's get a log. Yes, John. What's the deal? You have to move around. We talked about this, didn't we? I don't think you do. Timber. Two more. Three more there. Wow. This is why I need a sled. Right. In all seriousness, should we just make a sled now? Keep pressing the wrong thing to open this. Sled, sled, sled. So what will that be in? Storage or storage? Sled. It's 21 sticks. Do I need to make a stick holder in order to... No, 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 no. Don't need to do that. Right. So let's rotate that. Put that there. Put all the sticks we got into it. And then get more sticks. Honestly, I probably should have done this straight away at the start, shouldn't I? I don't know how you're not all just constantly backseating, being like, why haven't you done this yet? You're very patient. I appreciate it. You fucking idiot. Why haven't you done this yet? It's a bit like when you watch somebody play Rust for the first time, actually. Now that I've got a good like couple of hundred hours of Rust, I do know the basics. I'm no expert, but when you watch somebody play it for the first time, that is, that is a tough watch. Yes. Why is it on its side? Okay. Oh, look, and it's got a little sign on it. Thank you, Mac. I, I don't mind, though. It, like, if it gets... And Mary and anybody who's played it, if it gets to a stage where I'm like... 
if you're like, oh, he'll do this in a minute or he'll work that out in a minute and then I don't and I don't and I don't and I don't and it's something that you think, I, honestly, I know you well enough or like you well enough to know that you're helping me and not just getting too frustrated. Do I? No, yeah, I'm happy. This is great. Get Whale told me to do this about 45 minutes ago. Oh my god, I love this. I just see more sticks on the floor. The sled is incredible. But I, I came out here just to get fish. Nice, Murray, that's perfect, thank you. I imagine I'll be back playing this on Friday. In theory, it's one of the Tuesdays where I'm not doing the gymnastics class. I don't have to take Alex, so I could, in theory, play this until about six o'clock. <laughs> um, I imagine I'll get tired. Pat, I've now moved into a, probably a bad position. Can you see me? A bit low. Sit up a little bit. I, what's happened? Did I knock that down? Yes, here we go. How many can you get on here? This is great. This is going to... I'm going to build a, a shack in no time with one of these. Is that it? That actually scared me, that. Can I fit this log on there? What are we done? Wow! Okay, let's not take the piss. Let's go back. Is that just the sound of butterflies? Here we go. Can't see. Probably could press L. Can I use my lighter? Yes. Yes. Oh. <gasps> ah! I don't know what to do. Save. If in doubt, save. Yes. Yeah, I don't doubt the butterflies were that loud. Okay. Do I need to sleep yet? Oh my god, yes. Although it means it's another day, which is... What's happened? Is it? Can you not sleep because there are baddies? Fuck it. I'm ready. I'm not killing the bird. I... It would be easy for me to be like, ah, yeah, you're right, I'll just kill a bird. But genuinely would upset Llama and it's definitely not worth it, is it? Um, I need to eat. Right. Where's the fire? For starters. Shit! I've just saved. This is fine. Oh my god, I'm dying so quick. Just saved. I have a Molotov, but I didn't want to use a Molotov there. Also, I'd forgotten that I'd had Molotovs. Literally just saved. Is it this one? 322? Whoa, that's not just now. 338. That makes more sense. And am I still only on day two? 
338. Yeah, I thought I had sheep. Is it that I... How am I only on day two? Sleep. There we go. Oh my gilly goodness. Hello Sam, how you doing? Nice to see you, it's been a while. Thank you very much for the resub. How's it going? Have you put your stickers anywhere yet? <sighs> right. What are we doing again? Fires are annoying, aren't they? I'm quite I quite don't I don't really like fires in this game. Why does it take them so long to um oh sorry, why do they not last? I'm guessing the fire pit's probably the best way to go. Let's put the fire here. Okay, fine. Let's put the fire I put it on these rocks? No. Nope. Let's put the fire here. Not enough sticks, not enough rocks. Great. Once again, I'm on the hunt for fucking sticks. Did you start them on your laptop? Nice. I think you may have told me that. Did you tell me that already? I need rocks as well. One. One rock. I need one rock and then I can make my fire. Or oh, whatever it is I'm doing is that, isn't it? There's a lot going on. While we're here, should we chop down another tree? Yeah. Sorry, Sam. Bad memory there. won't this I think you do have to move around oh little little tree fart two logs back to base I like that you've got a little flag there for um my sled can falling trees kill you I don't know I don't think so but, oh you right there? Chaos. Right, I need to eat, so I need to finish this fire. Light it. Pot with water in it. Equip. Pot. Fish. There's two there's two two fish and then we'll hang up another fish here. What's going on there? These logs. Um and whilst that's cooking Shall I drink a soda or should I go and get some water? No. Let let's literally just get some logs because it's we can't go far while that's cooking. My, my health is very low. I'm not a fan of how often you need to eat. <clears throat> should we should we test and see if I can die under a tree? I'm not going to do that actually. The instinct is to do it, but I think that's a bad idea. I haven't saved. It's making the fire and stuff like that <laughs> for science. Right, let's get these logs with the other logs. Oh, this one's just rolling down the hill. 
Let's put these ones here to stop this one from rolling. Uh, fish, you ready? Yeah. Why didn't it show me eating it? Because I'm holding the axe. Okay. Do you? Cherry, you've got some great emotes. Is that a Molotov? What is that? A bottle with a question mark on it. Clue bottle. I like it. I really like your Sandy Toxic emote. Uh, and your face palm one. And your drag her one. Sorry, I'm just looking at your emotes now. Good stuff. And if you want a Cherry Burns emote, then you simply must follow and sub. Um, question, how many sticks? Eight. I'm going to make another log holder because it's going to take me a while to get to 80. And I absolutely adore storage. And we're just going to put it right next to the other ones. No, we're not because it's not going to let me. Eight sticks needed. Go, 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 go. Look at all these spare logs I've got lying about as well. Might as well pick up the stone. Eight sticks. Two sticks down. Three sticks down. Five sticks down. I lost track. Seven sticks down. That's your sticks. Doing speed runs now. Feeling quite hungry in real life. To tell you the truth. <gasps> Boom. Log. Log. Let's get these stored. C, 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 C. Log. Should we pick up a second log? Also, if they're all sorted out like this, then it's going to be easier for me to count how many I've got. Log. Log. CC, shall I take these ones out now? E, E, C, C. Why is it not letting me put any more in? Oh, that's how many you can get in. So what, you can get seven in each. Fuck, I need loads, don't I? Jesus, okay. I need to get 80. Oh my God. Oh, well, look. Sticks. Let's build more storage. Two sticks. Come on, sticks. Are those sticks? No, they're just bits of wood. I'm getting into the flow. Why won't it let me carry more sticks? That's why. Now what we're going to do, trees, we've turned it on so that trees do grow back. But when you first start in the settings, it's set so that the trees don't grow back. So I'm really chuffed that Llama mentioned that because that would have been shit. Oh, 
Oh, it's creaky, creaky trees. I thought it was somebody groaning. I think sleeping in a forest overnight would be really terrible and scary. Can't carry anymore. Okay. Exactly, Mary. <laughs> Come on. Stop breathing. Don't actually don't stop breathing. Can I put any more sticks in here? I wonder what the max amount of sticks you can get. If you missed the start of the game, this is the plane I came in on. Didn't go great, the landing. My child's somewhere, but I'm too busy trying to get sticks. Maybe I should be going on more adventures, but this stream hasn't been about adventures. It's been, it's been about getting into a decent position. To be able to survive. Basically, I need to build this fucking hut before I log off. And that might be a bold claim because I'm not even halfway to getting the amount of logs that I need. Does that hurt? Do you get full damage? Plenty of, plenty of learnings for sure. Right. Let's build another log holder. Here. Get some sticks. Thank you, Columbo. Columbo's chin. Okay, take a load of these out. Shove them in there. Grab, shove. Grab, shove. Grab, shove. Grab, shove. He's doing the old grab and shove. Oh, he's run out of space. Drop. Grab. Make another holder. Is this a waste of sticks? Many would think so. I just don't want to have 80 logs just lying all around. Am I out of sticks now? No. The logs, son. The logs. What are they doing? Thank you, Stothy. You want logs, you know where to come. And then we'll take the old sled out and we'll get a load of logs. I said that as if that was different from what else I've been doing. This is all log based at the minute. Uh, logs, somebody say logs. I feel quite full, which is good. As in, my stomach is... I feel like um, whatever I ate last is really keeping me going. Right, here we go. Can you make a suggestion? Yes, you can. Definitely. How do I pick this up? Save? Fucking yes. Thank you, Mary. Right, 338. Let's do this one. I wish I had a son. I wish I had a son in this game that I could send out. That's the sequel, Sons of the Forest. Oh, you can put rocks on there too. Okay, the question is, how do I pick this up? If you're committing to the house, can you just start the blueprint for that and build part with logs instead of storing them? Matt, that's exactly the, that's exactly the kind of time when it is very handy to say something. Because yeah, I guess you can do that. You're so right. That would be so much quicker. Fuck. Thank you, Matt. Right. Let's have a look at that. Uh, I mean, I could do a custom build. No, let's chill. Let's chill. Right. Log cabin. What is this? 
Is the bottom bit like foundation? Yeah, I think that makes sense. Okay, so let's. Where shall I have my log? I quite like the idea of having my log cabin. Oh, maybe not right by somebody's grave. But at the same time, how you make it, the more logs. But I guess it's safer, right? I might make it like that high and put it. Right. Oh, where do I put it? Maybe over here. Like here. Or do I oh shit. Ninety six. Maybe I don't worry about having it high. Log cabin. Just wondering if actually I'll mm. This is very important to me. If I get this right. Maybe here. Where's the door? There. Here. Eighty nine. I'm good with that. So you can put defense around you. Hmm. Yeah, I thought up against the rock would be good, but they can clamber over rocks, can they? God damn it. Oh shit, hold on. Wait. My niece is just messaging me about something. One sec. Um... Should we watch Best Mates? Pretty old school. Best Mates. I can't believe that we're all here together at the same time. You're in my chat, so we are best friends now. I think that's how it works. Are you my best friends or what? I provide stuff for you to watch and you provide me with... Feel the love, is that love? I think it's love, is it hate? I don't care, cause you're my best mate. You are my best mates now, please never leave me, don't go away. You cannot go away, we're your bestest friends. I can't believe we're best friends. Just to stop the friends in the world. Oh, that was quite nice hearing that again. I just feel bad playing it because there's still people who I haven't put in yet. But Right. The question is, do I want the door facing... I probably want it facing up there because let's face it, I'm mostly going to be going out into the woods and across. Um, Even though it would be nice for it to maybe look out... Ah, fuck it. Let's think about visuals rather than things that are actually are useful. Let's do it here. And we'll have it looking out onto the bay. Am I happy with that? Because I kind of placed it then without thinking. Yes, right. Let's log it. Let's start logging. All this storage that I didn't need. Oops. Oh my god. Oh my god. Stop breathing so much. That's because I'm sprinting in between. Should I use a sled to take them over there? Would that save the time in the long run? Probably. What am I going to do with all this storage now? Can you dismantle those? Do I get all the sticks back? Because that would be cool. Also, I'll need to dismantle my other hut. It's not really a hut, is it? But... 
Well, I hope you're enjoying this. There's about 10 minutes of this now. Building is cool. Logs, logs, logs. <laughs> Look at all these sticks. Oh yeah, okay. I'll leave that. I'll leave that hut as an emergency hut. Good shout. It is, isn't it, Slothy? Survive five nights. I've just got a little alert, but but when I'm saving, it's saying I'm on like day two. Let's do a save now whilst we whilst we're thinking about it. What's going on? I've done five nights. Or does that is that because I've also had to restart and stuff like that? Is it back to full price? Sorry to hear that, Mac. Cravings quashed. I uh, I had a craving last night to do something, and I had a, like an impulse to do something, and I nearly made a very, what might have been quite a silly, impulse purchase. And I was really good, and I didn't do it. Because usually I'm quite bad with that kind of thing. And then this morning I was like, good lad, good work. That was the right decision. Not saying I might not make that purchase, but I'm just, I'm not financially in, a, in the best position to be able to just do stuff like that. At the minute, until I start really sorting out my, um, getting more work in. No, no. Although I'd like to do both those things, Mac. Um, but um, yeah, I've, 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 I've done my tax return though and I have saved a fair bit more than I needed to. But usually I would then be like, right, well, if I save some of that money, I could use some of that money for some other bits I've been thinking about getting. But I'm just going to save it all till I'm like, until I've got a more secure regular income coming in. I've started off all right, but um, I just can't do anything frivolous. Oh, I'd love an actual Wedge FC kit. Uh, so look, let's face it. I'm hungry. So let's get a fish on the fire. This is the most organized I've been. Let's get a fish on the fire. Oh, do I need to equip it? Equip fish. Did I just eat it? Did I just eat it raw? Okay, fair enough. D, John. Oh, Mac, I used to love designing football kits at school. Me and Funkle Albert and, our, and Tom, our friend Tom, and uh, our friend Doug Edwards, who we're not mates with anymore. You know those four colour biros? We used to get a four color biro and then be like, right, there's your limitations. Those four colors, design a football kit. Fucking love doing that. I reckon I'd do that now. Let's do a little stream of that. So I lit the fire and I ate a raw fish. But it means I'm hung, I'm good. So let's just get some logs. Won't this, oh, let's take the sled. How do I move this sled now, by the way, everybody? This looks kind of fucked. Oh, here we go. Don't worry about it. Get the light on. Sleep first. Genuinely don't know how to let go of it. Okay. Should have tried that before saying that. Can I sleep yet? I can. Good shout, Polly. And then we'll save. Sleep and then save. C 
calm, the charity calm reduce, um, reduced. Let's actually look and see if this is true, what I'm about to say. I'm about to say something I'm not 100% sure on. They made a football kit. Excuse me. Here we go. Is this it? Uh, I feel like they made another one. They made a football kit with Carl Walker. Oh, nice, mate. Oh, God, that cough really got my throat. Uh, I feel like they made other kits. Because my mate Tom bought one of these. He definitely wouldn't have bought the Carl Walker one. Calm Football Club, Club Shop. Proud football kit supply for Calm Football Club. Wow, I can't imagine it was this either. Look at the goalkeeper shirt though. Swaz, what a brand. Oh my God, Mac, I, I want to play football with you. I play seven aside every Thursday, although I've been off for six weeks because of my knee. I mean, that's one of those shirts that might actually be nicer on when you buy it. But I'll just get the XXXXXXL. No. Oh, I might have to watch that, that Mac, before I play with you then, just in case you're shit hot. Right, here we go. Uh, this one. Oh, that last cough made my eyes water. Mm. I actually feel like I might need a little, little breather. Ugh. Let's have a little drink. Oh, nice. I think I peaked. I genuinely think I peaked for football at about 36. Um... But then I never played. I never played for any teams or anything. I only started playing. Oh, fuck, I'm going to die. Sorry, I've left the game running and I'm going to die because I'm really hungry. I, um, I've never played. And then I only I started playing seven aside when I was 30. And then absolutely loved it. And I've just sort of got better and better. And then I think, yeah, I probably peaked about 36, 37. But I reckon I'm all right now. I think I'm pretty decent, but um, it's just like fitness and stuff like that. Um, little reminder, if you missed it, if people weren't here at the start of the stream, the big news in our household is that Alex, who's my eight-year-old daughter, got a fucking blue Peter badge yesterday. Got that delivered, so that's exciting. Uh... Yeah. Oh, Polly, I saw a I saw a poster for um, walking football at the doctors the other day, and I had a good look at it. I was like, "How old are those people?" And I think they're in their sixties. I think I'm still good to run around for a little while. Yeah, my brother plays eleven aside, and he is fifty this year. My brother, he plays eleven aside most weeks in a, obviously in a senior team, like a senior league or an older person league. He plays centre-back as well, so there's not loads of running. But um, if he's still going, 49, that bodes well. That's a good point, Polly. I find it so hard not to run, though, on walking football. Me too, Tarantula. Matt played seven aside at uni where all my team were the... Where all my team were the, U, were the uni first team, and I honestly felt like a god... It was actually just because every time I put a cross in, my team was so much better than everyone else. Nice. But you thought you were the best midfielder. Banging out assists. Yeah, it must be hard not to run. The instinct is to chase the ball. 
Cool. Good rest. Let's get back into it. I'm definitely going to keep playing for a bit. I know I'm at three hours when I usually stop my streams, pretty much, but... Uh... Right. I need to eat. So again, let's light the fire. And then let's put some cash on it. That's all my cash now. I wonder what else I can put on fires. Let's grab a fish. And put a fish on there. And eat it immediately. Is it ready? Okay, and this is good because this is going to collect water now. What else can I put on here? The burned leaves. I've got fucking loads of leaves, so that's good. Should we put some leaves on? Stoke the fire. Okay, and now I need water and I need logs. So shh. Shall I go and collect some water? We haven't been out for water for a while. But also it's raining, so I'll get water. Like this. Fucking yes! Let's go get logs. Oh! Mary! What? So it just dries immediately? I thought that was like storage. Thank you. John, have you got a Blue Peter badge? What was it for? Was it for art? Right, okay, Mary. Thank you. That's actually great. I actually need to catch some more animals, so maybe we'll do that. In fact, let's go back over to the thing and see if there are, if there are more fish in there or if I've killed all the fish. And then, <coughs> We'll bring a load of rugs back on the way home. Rugs? Logs. There's more fish in there. The, the fish respawn too. If you hang it out for like a day, you can just eat away. Nice, so just stick five up and keep a few more in your pocket. Oh, uh, yes. Right, where's my... Um... Come on. Come on, you shit. I wish you could carry more than fish. More than fish? More than three fish. And I love the fact that I've got this marked. This has been a great stream for progress in this game. Right, is that all my fish? Yeah. Now let's do logs. Yes, Fluffy, I've made some saves. John, you did an unleaded petrol poster design competition, didn't win, but it's featured on TV. Shit, yeah, we've been meaning to, we need to, we record every episode of Blue Peter. Um, and I really want to, we want to watch them and just see, because there's a chance that Alex's artwork might get shown. Obviously, there's probably fucking loads of people who do that, so it also might not get shown. But if it did, that would be so exciting. She's at that age where just, like, that kind of thing would absolutely blow her mind. Mind you, if art that I did... Was appeared on Blue Peter that blow my mind, and I'm much older. We haven't seen any baddies for ages, have we? I like the way that bobbed along, floating. Is this all going really well? Feels like this is going really well. more 
love the sled. Can I not get any more on there? No, okay. That's fine. Let's chuck it in here. So we've got fish. Oh, let's get some water. We've got fish, we've got water, we've got logs. What a trip! Yes, Mac, but you probably didn't have people giving you little tips here and there. But that's good to hear. <laughs> good. That's a good advice, John. Love this sled. Absolute game changer. How many are on here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12. Before that, I could only carry two at a time. Beautiful. Park it up right here. And then we'll stick them straight in and then we'll get back out. Oh my god. Look at this. So efficient. I just want to make this. How many more? Hmm. We're about halfway. Hello, Cutter. I'm about halfway. Okay, that's good, though. Let's put the water. Can I put that down there? Where are those other pots, by the way? Was that just some weird glitch? I think that was a weird glitch, because I was going to go and fill up another pot with water. Um... We've got water there as well. We're, we're thriving! You can use the direction of trees falling down to knock more trees down. Do you think that would be fucking cool? Right, let's get some fish on here. See. 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 Incredible. Back out. For more trees. I'm a little bit hungry. But let's go get 12 more trees. I'm going to stream this until the hut is finished. If things keep going as well as they've been going. Okay. Let's just get these ones. What did... Why did it just make that noise? Look at that. Oh no, don't. Don't roll down the hill. Why does it not let me put them on? Is it, is it made me put a rock on? Pressing the wrong thing. Have they rolled down the hill now? No, we're good. We're good. Panic over. Shit. C, C. How could I forget? Oh, I need to wash. Good point, Pete. It's one of those games. Oh, I am stinky. Where, um... I'm going to be thinking about this a lot when I'm not playing it. And I'm going to be like prioritizing my plans. And it's also one of those games where I'll like come to play it next and be like, right, I'm going to do this, then this, then this. I won't do any of those things. Get distracted by other stuff. I do need to wash though. I'll be next streaming this Friday afternoon. For the foreseeable future, I reckon. Oh my god, I wish. I wish that was still accurate, Barma. I think exclamation mark Ross server. Give you the info that you need. Oh. Just bought Disco Elysium in a cell and used my Microsoft points to get it for free. Yes, sheep. So you're going to do your playthrough. What just happened then? Oh. Thank you, Sparkle Muffin. Although part of me wants to keep that in case we can persuade Paige to do it 
Um, is that is that Discord still about? The other thing I'm excited about is how many new people will be playing Rust next time it comes back. I I wonder if people like Pete and Slothy and better known as and people who may not have played on previous servers might be up for getting in. It all depends who runs the server, I guess, and what the rules are. Okay. Just drop this one here, let it roll down the hill. In fact, we could just do loads of that, rolling them down the hill to the hut. <gasps> yes, Barma. How <laughs> magical. Look at this. Oh. Oh. Okay, let's see if I can get one that lands right at it. So... Here? Yeah. Pretty good. This is the way. My niece made her train. Yes. She was texting me earlier about maybe missing her train and I may have had to have gone and driven her somewhere. She's getting the train to London. Just before you say, why didn't you drive her anyway? Sloffy. What the fuck, Sloffy? Rust is one of those games, at least it was for me, and I know it's been that for a lot of people, where you watch people play it, and then you're just absolutely desperate to play it yourself. Because you see how satisfying it is. Shit! To, uh to go and hit a rock hit that little sparkly bit on a rock oh not for you John not for everyone but I remember like spark um Mary biscuits and sheep boy having to be so good not when they had their exams and stuff or their papers and having to um Resist playing. Uh oh, my niece is. Okay, God. The next message I got from my niece was actually, and I thought he was going to say, actually, I need a lift, but it says, actually, can't believe I made it. She got the train. I love domes so much, Barber. Ah, oh, God. I want to run dome now. Is there a dome in this? Am I just going to get all my logs like this from now on? Oh, this is a good idea. Drop them this way and then I don't need to jump over them. That's learning. The rust skins! The skins cutter! Oh, I forgot I actually bought some skins last time on the last server. The first few times I played, I I, ne I didn't because I was like, I just need to learn the game. I don't want to spend money on this stuff. But then I ended up buying the uh, the last one I bought, like the building skins and got, I mean, cutters, you've got loads of great skins. But I've got skins for my all my boxes, my front doors, my garage doors. I love a garage door when you progress to have a garage door. The safety, the sound when it moves up and down. Oh my god, who's going to start a Rust server? Oh, is it going to be me? No. Oh my god, it was going so well. It's, it's not me. It's definitely not me. I haven't got the first fucking clue about it. Okay. 
Can we do a save? Because I do not want to have to do all those logs again. Uh, six of the fourth, six of the fourth. 8 p.m. No, 4.08 p.m. 3.02, 3.54, three, okay, it's this one. Ah, oh, spark on my fin. I don't think I'll, unfortunately, I think I've, I've sort of said before, but I don't think I'll ever join uh, Rusty Nuts or um, any of those ones. I just like it when the PvP ones pop up. The pure PvP, pretty much vanilla, apart from the remove tool and the three times stacks and the usual added little extras that we got used to. Okay. How does that work though? Surely with rusty nuts, surely because it's like always on, surely there are not many people playing it at all times. Like when you're doing a wipe, how many people are actually in? And this is um, this isn't a diss to that. It's just like having an always on server. I would have thought that must be hard to keep the population hi yeah and then if there's nobody in there then you're not i mean it's de it totally depends what experience you're looking for but um then you're not getting you know if you can just it's a good learning place i can see that but if you can basically just run around hitting barrels without any fear then it's not the same experience but definitely good for learning and picking up tips and perhaps in building and Stuff like that running monuments learning how to do monuments that's one thing i suppose is that it's taken me so long to learn how to do any of the monuments because you have to get proper tooled up for a lot of them before you can even attempt right drop that down there and then let's take the thingy my bob oh okay Sled down the hill. Not loads, but not empty. Diehard to have fun plans for every wipe. Yeah, that's that's hardcore. I guess there are people, like, you know, who just play Rust like that's their one game. Like people who just play DVD, maybe. I always think that for someone like Wiljum, it must feel quite a lot like a job, but like literally putting out a new video every couple of weeks. Uh, trying to come up with new ideas. Pick that one up. Right, how close are we? 24 left to go. Yes, Pete. Nice. Yeah, you should give it a game. Uh, give it a go. Give it a game. I was about to say. You should. Um, uh, thanks for going back and watching some of those vods as well. They're difficult sometimes because sometimes there's like hours of not much happening. It'd be nice to have made some highlights. Let's do it. I'm hungry, but we've got fish. All right, let's let's eat some fish and then let's do it. Could argue I should also save. Stop getting out of breath from picking up a fish. Let's also save because of all that log work. Oh, yes. Night time's coming, but let's go and get some logs. Oh, really, Mac? A really sheep boy. Love breathing, I do. I just find it to be vital. Look at all these logs. Oh. No. 
Sparkle. Please keep doing it. Look at these loose logs. Loose logs. Sink frogs. Fucking hell, John. Yeah. How are you doing? I hope you're bearing up all right. I could I could do with some teeth, so I'm not afraid to. Oh, these are bad ones. Are they coming for me? Ah! Where are they going? I'll run over here then. Why didn't they come for me? Oh my god! Am I being sneaky? Why is the eye there? What does that mean? I'm crouching. Why has it got even more dark? No, I mean some hidden. It's, I seem to have the eye when I'm crouching. Please. Are they destroying my base? Because that will be a quick game and never play it again situation. <laughs> Hit some trees, not worry about that for now. I can't see anything, guys. I'm sorry you can't see anything, but I can't either. I'm going to press the lighter on so I can actually see where the tree is. This trusty lighter. Oh, so I really need to wash. That's a lot of logs from that one. Yeah, look at that. Loads of logs from that one. Okay. We're going to pick up these logs. Oh, it's kind of dark. Okay, here they are. And then when we've done this, we're going to wash. I really want to finish this. I'm in no rush to stop streaming, but I'd like to maybe finish around five if I can. But um, I can go a bit over. If I get back to find they've knocked over my cabin. But it's not built though, so you'd think... Oh, who knows? Where are the rest of the lugs? Did I pick them all up? Let's just do this. <clears throat> Matt, don't worry about it. Absolutely no hard feelings towards you. That totally makes sense to, to do what I've done there. Hello, Funkle. Have you started your new job, Funkle? It's June, I've just realised. Have you started the new job? Oh, I was pressing the title wrong. Yeah! Amazing. How's it going? Shout out Funkle Albert who is um 
back working after quite a big uh, gap in the end for various reasons, mostly good. Uh, but Funko has a job and is going to be earning money again. I fucking, I've, I keep losing. Right, let's just take these down. That's really good news. I knew he'd got the job, but I'd forgotten that he was starting. It does sound like they're being bad down there, doesn't it? Still here. It's still here. Matt, don't panic. Fourteen months. There's going to be a shock to the system as well. Getting back to work. I think you'll find some fulfilment, like doing a good day's work and feeling good. But then I can also imagine you doing a good day's work and then being like, "Oh fuck! Now I've only got like three hours before I should go to bed." What the fuck? I used to have so much time. Nineteen left to go. I can pick up two at a time, can't I? Well, Twelve more. That's one more run. One more full run. Look at this. Oh my god. Just stay up later. But then surely you're going to have to get up and be ready to work at 9am now. And you've got a child, Funkle. I worry about when you're going to sleep. Speaking of sleeping. Yes. Save. Yes. We are really doing good here. Thank you, Mary. You must be proud. You must be proud to watch such growth. Right. Let's fill up this. And we're so close to finishing. I've got a hut. I'm building it. I need 12 more logs. I've noticed that Taft's gone quiet since he said that he downloaded um, Football Manager. Taff, if you're here, if you're still lurking, you're probably busy with the fam. Who are you? What are you? No. Uh, who are you? What team are you? That's all I need to know. We can DM about other details. Twelve more logs. I should have eaten some fish. Yeah, Cutter, I forgot that you picked Brighton. But do you know why I picked them? Primarily because they're my local Prem team. And I've always grown up near them. But also because I always do a little search for who has the biggest transfer budgets. I do a search for who has... Because quite often you think a team will have a big budget and then they don't because they've already spent it in real life. Brighton had a very big budget. They had like 70 million or something. Anyway, I could talk loads about this, but... Most people will find it boring. Yes. Oops. Yeah, Evan Ferguson is stunned. I mean, I'm only in my second season, so... Look at this half cut down tree. Cutter, we'll talk. We'll talk. And then we'll do a network sound. Capriso, how are you doing? Is it as is it is it as satisfying as Rust though? It's, it's a shame that I'm comparing so much of this to Rust. Should let it Should talk about its merits by themselves. And there are a lot of merits. It's really fun. Really poly. Exactly. Remember last time on one of the last wipes realizing i had a neighbor and being like yeah right i'm i'm going to be a bad boy on this on this wipe i'm going to kill people a lot more and then going to attack them and finding out it was capriso 
be like, well, one, they're really nice and I know them in real life. Like, I know them from the, the gang and I don't really want to kill them. And two, they're actually really good at Rust. So they'll just kill me back again and again and again till I quit. We've made a sled. Uh, I'll show you my progress. You've come back at a really good time. Caprice, I had no choice but to be a good neighbour. How many have I got there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Right, you can do one. Taff, you've honestly come back at such a good time. Look. What's down there? What needs 12 logs? I've said I'm going to keep streaming until I complete my cabin. And I'm about to complete the cabin. Also, I've been eating, saving, drinking. I mean, I really need to eat now. Drying out fish. I'm going to drink some water here, look. Life is good. Ralph! Thank you, Fluffy. I want to see what these are actually building. I don't like that it's slightly flo floating, the steps. Oh, I'll learn. I'll learn to love it. Get the cannibals around for a little housewarming. So can I make a bed in here? Will this just be my house now? Here we go. Final two. I mean, it looks like I need three. Oh. Why is it not letting me put this on? <gasps> to-do list updated. What to-do list? Set up camp. What? Find Timmy, find my son is number one on the list. I haven't done that, but I have found and cooked food and I have set up a camp. So I need to set up defences and I need to find the other passengers. I found quite a few of the passengers already. I don't know if that, how I can check that. Don't really know what I'm doing with these pictures. Fucking yes. Right, let's see my base. What's all this? Oh, this is my bed. Oh. <laughs> oh, right. Let's have a save here. Definitely feel much safer in here. So I can't get attacked when I'm in here. Or can they can they knock down the door? Yes. Right. Now. I'd quite like... Can I move this storage? I don't really need this anymore. Can I break it? What's the deal with this? Can I break these? Doesn't look like it. Moves, maybe, but... And I've got my... I'm going to keep this forever. I'd quite like to move some of this stuff. Does anybody who's played the game know if that's possible? doesn't look like you can pick it up like in rust 69 viewers right now nice <sighs> Taffy you there Mac are you there Mary are you there 
Can you pick these up? Can you pick these up? Big Taff Man. Love Big Taff Man. Can you pick them up? I don't know how to move these. Or is that it now? Just the remnants of my old storage system. Don't leave me hanging. No. That's a shame. That's a bit silly, isn't it? Because there's materials there. And look, they're clearly just some sticks. I could do I could do with those sticks. That would be really cool if I could get all those back. No, I haven't made a birdhouse. I've just spent my whole time getting on, to on top of the food and water situation and then collecting 89 logs. Uh, let's have a quick look at what the birdhouse is, though. Is it a shelter? I mean, it's a shelter for birds. Not storage. Zip line? Oh my god. I'm, I'd love to do all this at some point, but I don't think I'm ever going to get to this level by myself. I'd like a bone frame. I should make some traps. Oh, I've got all those sticks over there would be really good. Oh. And look, these traps will kill the, the baddies. Spikes would be good. Walls, definitely. We're going to have to get a load more logs. I'd love to do a chainsaw. I wonder when I find a chainsaw. I think if you demolish some stuff, it drops things. Um, Funkle, I will answer that in just a sec. Right, I think I'm going to end it there. I think that's been a productive stream. We've learnt a lot. We haven't died for ages. Uh, we've got some fish there. Friday afternoon, I'm going to do a load of hunting. Yeah, I was. I couldn't find it. Where is it? <laughs> I did just stop looking at it, though. Where would Birdhouse be? It'd be good if you could search for stuff, wouldn't it? Like, type stuff in. It's not fire. It's not shelter. There are no other food options. Maybe a garden at some point. Traps and stuff. Birdhouse, no birdhouse, no birdhouse, no birdhouse. Furniture. Custom building, storage, shelter, shelter, fire, boat, signals. Why am I being annoying? Furniture, here we go. Fireplace, couch, bone chair, side table, lamp, skin, skin, lamp. Da, 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 da. Birdhouse. Four sticks, one log. Easy. I mean, that looks massive. Why is it so big? We just have it at the back here. Okay, no, let's let's line up because you know this needs to be perfectly central. Oh my god. Right. Fuck, now I need to do this. Please say I've got four sticks here. Two. Two? Two sticks, one log. Easy. Easy. Go, 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 go. Have I even got any spare logs around here? No. Two sticks, one log. Yeah, 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 Taff, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine. Let's do it. 
These trees aren't growing back very quick. Two sticks. One log. Yes. It does look like it could catch Big Bird. Dexter of skulls to really cheer the place up. Yeah. Tai Tai, you were right. Fucking yes, it's not it's not perfectly in the middle. It'll do. So eventually I'll get some um feathers from that. Which I need to be able to make arrows. That's it. That's been a really good day. This has been a really fun game. Three streams of this in, and I'm really enjoying it. I could see at least another three streams. Hopefully more. I don't know if I'll just do this and this and this and this. Maybe I'll do something else on Monday night. Um, I think I'm on day... Well, it's weird. I've got an achievement to say that I've done five nights. But I think I'm only on day three or four. Today was good. Thank you very much for the help. I love head trophies, says Taff. And David replies, they give trophies for that. And then Big Taff, man, I'm not even going to read that out. Really enjoying this game. Thanks for the stream. Thank you, Frosty. Appreciate that. Let's have a save. Yeah, because look, I'm, oh, day five. I'm on day five. Confirm. Thank you, Cherry. Thank you, everybody. Uh, let's exit. I feel I feel pretty knackered after that, I must say. Yes. Oh, don't tell me there's a lock. Is there a lock? Shit. Sparkle Muffin, when you were throwing stones up in the air and trying to catch them, I genuinely thought you were going to bin it. I did catch one of them, though, so pretty cool. Oh, yeah. Big Taff Man streaming tonight. I know he's not trying to do self-promo here, and he meant my... But um, Big Taff Man streaming Pokemon tonight. A lot of Pokemon streamers at the minute. Cudder, Big Taff Man. I've got no interest. Zero interest in it, but um, I wish you all the best in your future endeavours. Uh, big Taff Man. <laughs> Sorry, that was unnecessarily harsh. I have got interest because you are the people who are streaming it, and I, I like Taff <coughs> and Cudder. And I can't, uh, but I don't know. Basically, I think it's a good opportunity to not watch some Twitch. <laughs> that sounds terrible. I'm trying to promote you. I'm trying to promote you. What I'm... <laughs> <coughs> a good opportunity to not watch some Twitch. Check out Big Taff Man tonight. What I mean is, for me personally... When Cudder was playing uh, that yesterday, I was like, okay, I feel okay now because I know I'm going to do loads of work rather than getting sucked into this stream. Anyway, Big Taff Man, uh, if you like Pokemon, which everybody seems to like, Big Taff Man, so don't worry about it. And also, Taff has got an amazing video, amazing intro video, um, a little promo video. I haven't seen Cudder's yet, but I'm sure he's, that's in the works. Um, but no, Cudder had some cool graphics and stuff. They're both smashing it. It's really fun. If you're into Pokemon, watch it. If you're not into Pokemon, watch it anyway. Uh, I think we've, um, I think we've, uh, we've uh, got back on track. Everyone seems to like it. <laughs> uh, we have fun. I'll be back Friday. with more the forest let's raid somebody uh, let's have a little old look who's streaming Trevor Flaps we raided the other day Zaffa's just started streaming Drea Jibbers Sir Hannah is doing Planet Zoo and Alias is doing Final Fantasy 10.30 I might just raid 10.30 
Um, and you can do a suggestion if you like, Sparkle, but I always feel a bit bad if I then don't follow through on the uh, suggestions. What time is it? Uh, five o'clock. Sorry, sorry for the indecision. Let's not rate 10.30. Uh, <laughs> that would have been really good. Thank you, Capriso. Um, I'll read the DM and then you can tell you can tell by my reaction. Discord opening. Didn't have Discord open. DM from Sparkle Muffin. Go fuck yourself, it says. Thunder Roof is raising money for Palestine. I don't know who that is, but if Sparkle recommends them and they're raising money for Palestine, let's do it. Uh, raid. Search. Member of Pickle Bees community. Sounds good to me. Oops. Thunder. Ruth. Playing Tony Hawks. Yeah. Medical aid for Palestinians. Day 21 charity fundraising stream. Nice. Okay. I've got a DM from Taff. <laughs> that is amazing, Taff. Has anyone else seen that? Can I show that, Taff? Have you put it on social? Okay, Mary's seen it. Can I, sh can I show it then? Because it is promoting your stream and I feel like I need to get back on track. Big Taff man. Big Taff man. Pokemon Arceus. It's not just a phase. Look at this. So this was originally a picture of Mary Biscuits that Mary put in Cutters or Taft's Discord uh, of when Mary, when was this? 20 years ago, did you say? <laughs> Big Taft man. That is so good. Look at Mary's bed. Pokemon. Love it. Look at the boots. Fucking cool. And the long tights. The like knee socks things. But those boots are amazing. I'd love to wear a pair of those. Are they fucking heavy? Let's do the raid. Thunder Roof streaming for medical aid for Palest Palestinians. Uh, playing Tony Hawks at the minute, which I played on stream and was absolutely shit at. Um, wedging in a pair of those boots would be perfect, actually. I don't think I'd be able to get down. Anyway, thanks, everyone. We're going over for the raid. Um, support if you can, follow if you can, donate if you can. Um, but mostly let's do a lovely big hello and um, be kind see you later I'll be back on Friday thanks for everything sorry Taff and Cudder